You sure you're at the right party? This is a celebration for the Saints, is it not? Business with Marshall is less lucrative than it used to be. I was hoping your bosses would be interested in a new partnership. I'd knock if I were you. Hello? It's Antonio Espina. <clears throat> Look, I, I know that we don't have the best history, but I was thinking, hoping, really, that we could work something out. Glad you came to your senses. Hey, I'm kind of having a party right now, but we'll talk business later. We got a party going on, so I'm gonna keep this one short and sweet. Fuck the Panteros, fuck the Idols, fuck Marshall. The Saints are here to stay, baby. So if you know how to shoot a gun or if you're broke and want to learn how, swing by the church. We'll be waiting for you. Why? Hello, and welcome to Marshall Defense Industries. You know it wasn't easy getting here. Your journey began with one of the most unforgiving job interviews we could devise. But you did more than just survive a few live fire exercises. You excelled, and in doing so, proved that you were Marshall material. But don't take my word for it. Hear it from the man himself. Hello, I'm Atticus Marshall. And I wanted to personally welcome you to the Marshall family. Here at MDI, we don't just make a problem. We make the world a better place. So how do we do that? With a little TLC. Technologically advanced weapons. 
loose morals, and a culture of conflict. Now let's take a step through each of those letters. Why are you watching that now? It's the orientation video. I know what it is. Why are you watching it now? Well, I mean, we're about to be shot at, so I figured it couldn't hurt to brush up on our healthcare package. If you weren't paying attention to the briefing, I don't think you'll live long enough for your copay to matter. So I should be reviewing the life insurance policy. You know, our job interview has a 5% mortality rate. Statistically, the odds were low that you would die before we hired you, but I allowed myself to be an optimist. Your parents should have treated you better. Yours should have treated you worse. All right, ladies and gentlemen, contrary to your colleague's demeanor, this is no laughing matter. The Nawali already took out one team that was sent to bring him in, and I want as many of us going home as possible. So stick to the plan, work together, and let's grab that son of a bitch and send him to the frontier. Let's get paid. Alpha team, go. First day on the job. Don't fuck up. Noobie, catch up. Right. Let's kick some holy shit! Turrets! They cover! Ugh. That was cut. Jesus Christ! It's my first fucking day! Shit! Anybody left? Me, I think. Great. We have to rendezvous with Bravo people. We're dead. Keep pushing forward. I'll meet you there. Copy that. Welcome to the Daily Grind! Shit, that helps. Hey, you! We gotta find... Fuck! Better hustle, newbie! Bravo team is ready to move in! I'm not exactly taking a coffee break here! Marshal scum! Oh, bite me! Newbie, you still alive? You sound like you lost the pool. Fall in. We'll use this APC for cover. A rolling shield. Nice. Nah, I'm delighted you approve. Bailey, make a hole. Roger that. Now let's go! Through the breach! Go, go, go! <laughs> Keep it up, team. Let him have it. Yeah, you guys fucked with the wrong multinational private military corporation. Hey, this may be a weird time to ask, but do we get hazard pay? You get a performance bonus for outstanding work if you survive the collector. Got it. Just trying to understand the pay structure. Move closer! Bailey, hold up! Marshal, clear the field! Yes, ma'am! Turn it down! Shit! Woo! Take the turret! I got it! I'm good with these! Look at that! You are damn lucky we don't have time to argue! See? Told you I was good with these. Just shut up and shoot. Dead, or there's no signal. So I just push on and find the Nawali myself. The things we do for rent.
At least I don't have to wear a suit. Finally, end of the tunnel. Gwen, hello? Do you read me? No, you still alive? Yep, I hear that a lot. The Nawali told up in the saloon up ahead. Rendezvous with the rest of us and we can box him in. In a minute. Gonna clear out some goons first. I gave you an order. It's on my way. Besides, we don't want them coming up behind us later. Fine. But next time I give an order, the only words I want to hear are yes and ma'am. Got that? Uh, yes ma'am. that performance bonus. Guess you assholes are just working stiffs too, huh? Little C4 should take out that barricade. <laughs> Couldn't do that at my last job. Newbie, over here! Glad you could join us. Let's move. We gotta keep the Nawali hold up until Charlie team arrives. Newbie, once we hit the saloon, you flank left while the rest of us hold the center. Flank? But I can... Yes, ma'am. Saloon's right around this bend. Get ready and remember the plan. All right, team. Let's take it. I can tiger a plane hiding sick. See? I'm flanking left, as ordered. This one's not been for it. Probably because of my flanking. Uh huh. Now get in there and flush that son of a bitch out. What does it take for a man to be able to enjoy a quiet drink these days? Mr. Nawali, you're coming with me. You really think you have what it takes to bring me in? I mean, yeah. <laughs> Where are you fucking going? I said you're coming with me! Perhaps I don't respect your authority. Then respect this! You set one foot on those stairs! Holy shit! No, you goddamn don't! Give it up to Wally! There's nowhere to hide! You're surrounded! Make it easy on yourself! What the? I can't find him! Never mind. Get back here and regroup. We've got the bastard bottled up with nowhere to run. We know he's in the saloon. He can't stay in there forever. What the fuck? Thanks for the ride. I'll see you around. We need air support now. Stand down. We don't got time for hero bullshit. Don't worry. I got this. Gwen, we 
We've got a problem. Hang on. The cavalry's coming. Oh, shit. <laughs> Brains. Goddamn right I do. You're too predictable. Try it. I'll give you that. Get your hands in the air! <coughs> I caught him! Well, you didn't die. All in all, not a bad start. Jesus Christ! You're not gonna last. Your pep talks need some work. This is for you. Performance bonus. Is this a joke? You, uh, you ribbon the rookie? What were you expecting? There's supposed to be a bonus based on exceptional performance. That's right. And if you had performed exceptionally, you would have seen a bonus. Oh, come on. Can you really look me in the eyes and say I didn't do well? I can look you in the eyes and say you didn't do what you were told. I saw a better way and I took it. And if you were in charge, it would have been an inspired decision. But you're not. I am. This is a warning. Fall in line or find a new job.
fall in line? Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it! God fucking damn it! God fucking damn it all! Every last fucking bit! God damn it all! Motherfucking microscopic, itsy bitsy, teeny weeny, son of a bitch, bastard ass, tiny little shit sucking bit of it! Full of wine. up a slamming congratulatory brunch for when you get home to celebrate your first day on the job. It's gonna be dope. Oh, and it's official. I'm gonna be spinning at that idols party I told you about, so hope you can come. TTYL. Hey there, it's Nina. So excited about your new gig. I thought you'd want to know. I, I heard back from the museum. Uh, they, they went with someone else for the junior art curator job, so looks like I'm still stuck with Los Panteros. Anyway, Glad one of us had a good day, at least. See you soon. Hey, it's Eli. Congrats on your first day as part of the workforce. Speaking of which, um, when you asked to borrow my copy of Be Your Own Boss, I assumed it was because you wanted to read it, not to level out the coffee table. So let's talk about that when you get back. Can't wait to hear about all the HR forms I'm sure you had to sign. Everything smells amazing, Kev. You know what would make it smell even better? Hey, man, if you want a $300 waffle maker, you can buy it with the exposure the idols pay you in. Don't expect us to chip in. I've told you before, the idols are trying to build a post-capitalist society where money is not a concept. Yeah? Then why don't you go run off and join the commune? I'm into showering. Are you going to help me get the waffle maker or not? As an investor, I don't like wasting money. You're wearing a fucking bow tie. <sighs> okay, I will throw in 20 bucks for a waffle maker. Nina? Um, good for ten? Who helped you move your forged paintings last month? Fine, fifteen. W what sort of waffle maker can I get for thirty-five bucks? Uh, presumably one that makes fucking waffles? Mm -hmm. hey. <laughs> hey! The wage slave is back! How was your first day? Were the other mercenaries nice to you? You know, as far as hired killers go, I'd give them a seven. You look like you could use a mugmosa. Thanks, Eli. Seriously, how's the job? Uh, it's the murder business. The fundamentals don't change, just the uniform. Uh, I can tell you love it. Okay. I don't have to love it, I have to pay my student loans. Poof. <laughs> I'm in. So, I'm guessing that means the pay's good. Uh, it's supposed to be. Got stiffed on my bonus today. Dude, what the fuck? Uh, I played a little fast and loose on the job, and, uh, well, I see I wasn't a fan. You gotta be kidding me. I swear to God, this lady walked right off the set of an 80s action movie. I was half expecting her to call me Rook and threaten to take my badge. Are we gonna make rent? We'll make rent. We just gotta be a little more creative. Last time we got creative, I got stabbed three times. Hey, it would've been four times if Nina and I hadn't shown up. It would've been zero times if you were on time. This is true. Look, this is really not a big deal. We just knock off a payday loan place. No one gives a shit if people rob those bastards. You have a job now. You could actually just take the loan. Eli, I don't do business with morally bankrupt companies. You work for Marshall. Brunch is a time for friends and mimosas, not debates on morality. All right, all right. Man, this is really fucking good, Kev. Thanks. I was worried I added too much pepper. Mm -mm. Mm, no, seriously, this is perfect. The only way this could be better is if you put on a fucking shirt. Dinner and a show, baby. Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> okay, brunch is done, dishes are clean. Let's go rob a payday loan place.
And you know how we should celebrate afterwards. Karaoke! Yes! So, Nina, are we taking your project car? Fuck no, I'm not risking my baby over rent. We're boosting cars from down the street. Ooh! Can we take a hybrid? Eli, I love that you're worried about fuel efficiency, but I'm thinking acceleration is gonna matter more. Your carbon footprint always matters. Just take that yellow one. That's mine now. Kev, you case the place. What are we looking at? One guard out front, the owner at the till. He's a real scuzzbag. I want some kick a dog. So, you know, fuck that guy. What's there? Let's get psyched. But only you oh, can no, decide how not you this react crap to again. Hey, only what's the you rule? can choose. Don't yuck someone's yum. The changes that life throws your way. You have more agency and power than the world wants you to know. But to realize that power, there's something you need to do. You need to be your own boss. Be your own boss. That's right. Be your own boss. One of these days, I'm gonna get you to listen to music in the car. Roger McGillicuddy speaks the music of my soul. You are a different kind of cat, Eli. What can I say? The world is full of uninteresting people, and I'm not gonna be one of them. You got one of those for me? You really want one after last time? I am not the first person to accidentally shoot a friend by dropping a loaded... Yeah, okay, I don't need a gun. Good call. Showtime. So I made them watch while I broke their dad's... Ah, oh, shit. Walk away, or the phrase dead-end job gets literal. I don't have much- We don't want your money, just his. Get out of here. You done fucked up. I've been getting that a lot lately. Where's a safe? If you're lucky, the cops will get to you before my people go. <laughs> nice left. Been practicing. I can tell. Safe's back here. This guy had his password be a bunch of fives. Pick it up, Eli. I'm just saying, he could have at least made his work for it. Same plan as last time. Eli, Kev, pretend traffic laws matter and get the money home. Nina and I will split up and give the cops the runaround. Cool, let me get the McGillicuddy. No! no! Try to keep up this time. Yeah, yeah. See you at the switch. Time to beat it before the cops show up. Life is full of adversity and challenges. But oh, fuck no. I'm monitoring the police scanner. They just responded to the call. Cops are now en route to the painting place. Sounds like they're out in force. Bad time for a train. I gotta lose these guys. Try sideswiping them. It always works for me. Just let them get alongside you, and then bam, send them into a ditch. Not going fast enough to do any damage. Hit them when they're right up next to you. It really gets them flying. You'll do more damage the faster you go. took care of him. How's everyone else? Eli and I made it home with the money. 
You ready for karaoke? Start warming up those voices. Nina, where you at? Just changed cars and headed home. Good. Headed to my switch car now. It was safe and sound at the junkyard a minute ago. That's pretty deep in Pantero's territory. Did you tell your gang you did that? Are you kidding me? If Sergio knew we were running a job on his turf, he would have taken a 90% cut. 90%? Good God. The man's either a monster or a capitalist genius. did you assholes do to my getaway car? Ain't your car if it's on our turf. Now you're gonna pay for parking. I don't have time for this shit today. You're gonna die for that shit damn car. Things I do to pay my rent. I needed that fucking car. Problem. Los Panteros scrapped my switch car. Hey, what? Bigger problem. The police picked up that firefight at the junkyard. They're heading your way. Grab a bike and head off-road. I'll pick you up in the desert. Damn. Sounds like no karaoke tonight. Every fucking time, man. I'm on my way. There's a trail that goes between the mesas. I'll meet you on the other side. Got it. Do I want to know what happened to the Panteros who stripped your car? Sorry, Nina. Self-defense. Fuck, I didn't want that to happen. Let's hope Sergio never finds out it was us. You free and clear yet? Not at all. I've got cops up the ass. I'll pick you up on the other side of the bridge. You said you didn't want to risk your car. I said I didn't want to risk it for rent. I'd risk anything for you, dummies. So, is this how it's gonna be every time we have to pay rent? I thought that went great. Yeah, okay. Maybe I can go back to running my old side hustles for extra cash? Don't worry. We'll figure it out. This town is full of opportunities. If you know where to look. Hey, glad you made it home safe. We have to get better at this rent thing or we'll never get to do karaoke again. Also, we'll get evicted. Nina said you might go back to some of your old side hustles. I have some friends who might need work done in your area of expertise. When you say friends, do you mean friends friends or special friends? All my friends are special. I'll put their info on your map. I think you'll really like them. I like them fine as long as their money's good. Thanks, Kev. Newbie, 
I've assigned you a driver for your next job. Meet us at the rendezvous. I'll be right there. That's a keeper. I've had enough of this. Hey. Too much. My bidet changed my life. Looky here. I don't like this shit. Bravo! Finders keepers. It's mine now. Stay the hell out of Pantero's business. My lucky day. There you are. Where is everyone? I didn't need everyone. Just you. Because I'm the only one who could get it done. Sure, let's go with that. Sergio, huh? You're familiar with Panteros? I mean, my roommate's one of them, so yeah. Oh, don't give me that look. Rent's expensive. Is this gonna be a problem? I mean, per the roommate code, I'm gonna have to fold her laundry for two weeks, but beyond that, I'm golden. What are they moving? Antiquities, mostly. The Nawali was waiting to sync up with them before he was captured. You mean before we captured him? I'm pretty sure you were about to die when I came along and saved your ass. And yet, if I hadn't stalled him, he would have got away. So, you're welcome. Do you want it to look like an accident or a statement? What? Well, I'm assuming you want me to make the convoy disappear? No, I want you to follow it. So I can kill everyone and retrieve the stolen goods. So we know where they're going. Sure, and then I kill everyone and retrieve the stolen goods. No. 
Then you will report back to me, I will arrive with the team, and you will go home and hit the showers before you have a chance to fuck it up. You think I can't do this? I think you like getting a paycheck. Follow the convoy. Don't fuck it up. Hey there. Name's JR. We about to see some action? Nope. Orders are to follow the convoy, observe its activity, and report back. Seriously? The convoy's right there. You know, I heard about you. I'm a little bit of a maverick myself. Two crazy badasses like us, we're not gonna mix it up? No. My friends are counting on me to get my performance bonus. I can't afford to screw it up. We don't engage. Just observe and report. Looks like them motorcycles are falling back. Probably just dropped something. We're gonna put you down! You gonna just let them shoot at us? When it's very clear I'm not engaging. If we don't do something, all we're gonna observe and report is getting dead. Fine. Just this once. <laughs> That's how I like to ride. Stop pulling! I always had it. Okay, back on track. From now on, observe and report. Oh, fuck. They have a turret. You can't take this kind of fire forever. Our orders are to follow them. No can do. Unless you want to take that thing out. I... God damn it. Get in closer. Wait, what are you doing? Taking out the turret? From the roof? No, from the truck. Get me closer. You're out of your goddamn mind. I thought you said you were a maverick. A little bit. I said a little bit. Following orders is harder than I thought. Heads up. You got more incoming. Oh, come on. I was almost done. Oh, as long as I'm here. Ruby, why am I seeing gunfire at the back of that convoy? When? Well, there were motorcycles, and then a turret, and one thing led to another. Well, that was You don't sound mad. Did you honestly think I would send one car after a convoy that size? You're just a distraction. We got a drone following these motherfuckers. Wait, you use me as bait. That's the job you were born for. Mission accomplished. Now finish what you're doing and get out of there. JR, pick me up. I can't get close. That truck's on fire. Shit. Us. 
Shoot him! Shoot him! You think you can take my shit? He's coming again! Push him back! Nobody steals from Sergio! A six. Back off, asshole! I see a way out. Keep your head down. It's gonna be tight. Hey. You think that guy's compensating for something? Don't count him out. It'll take more than a car wreck to kill that some bitch. Okay, time to finally get the fuck out of. What is that? Sandstorm. We're going in. Come in, newbie. Gwen, we hear you. We're falling back. Negative. The drone is down. I need... Need eyes on that convoy. I'm giving you field command. Huh? Really? Do what you gotta do. Follow the lead truck until it stops, then radio... They are? Let's get them. The kid gloves are off. The kid gloves are on? Uh, too easy. I see the main convoy ahead. Uh, we got a problem here. Be more specific. Sand's clogging up my intake. We're losing speed. Great. Just get me into jumping range, then fall back. That's suicide. I got us this far, didn't I? I don't want to be a maverick no more. End of the line, motherfucker. Ah! You won't leave this desert alive. You can't take all of us. Ah! 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 Do not test me. Ah! Ah! I had strict orders not to do this. I'll flank him! Ah. Enough of this shit! Ah. You'll pay for wrecking our convoy! Ah. Ah. Still got sand.
Hey, Gwen. I followed the convoy. It, uh... It stopped. You did good. Holy shit, a compliment. Yeah, yeah. Stay here. Newbie, get over here. Now! Gwen says you were responsible for retrieving the Hummingbird Codex. If that was something in the truck, then yes. Impressive work. I wouldn't have been able to do it without JR, sir. Team player. I like that. There's someone I'd like you to meet. This is Dr. Antonio Espina. He's the chief curator for the Museum of Santo Aliso. It's nice to meet you, sir. The retrieval of these relics is no small feat. The museum is in Marshall's debt. Just doing my job, sir. Antonio's museum has a contract with Marshall, and he requested you to be in charge of security. What? Gwen's filled me in on your eccentricities, but the results speak for themselves. Sir, it's my second day. Sounds like someone wants to talk themselves out of a promotion. No, oh, no, I want the job. I'm just surprised. Things change fast here at Marshall. So, can Antonio and I count on you or not? Yes, sir. way up high. Hey there, it's me, JR. From Marshall? I got a favor to ask if you got a minute. Might be a little something in it for you, too. Eh, I'm not doing anything else. Be right there.
Hey, JR. What's up? Well, after that little clusterfuck we had with the Panteros, you know, when my life was flashing before my eyes, I started thinking about early retirement. Seems fair. Took my bonus and savings and bought this empty lot. I'm fixing to open my own garage. Trouble is, a pack of those idols anarchists made off on my shipment of car parts. Without it, my garage is gonna fail before it even opens. And you want me to get the shipment back? After our last run, I figured this should be easy. I'd make it worth your while. Say, a percentage of the garage? A percentage? I'm in. Hey, yo. Kev, quick question. The idols robbed this guy I know. Any idea where they'd take his stuff? Probably to the camp. This friend of yours some rich bigwig? Nope. Just a regular Joe trying to make ends meet. That doesn't sound right. The idols are about taking down the corrupt system, not the little guy. Yeah, and they never get overzealous. Well, just be careful, okay? The idols are like a family to me. I promise I'll be nice to them. That must be the camp. The Collective really know how to throw a party. Who the hell are you? I'm, um, looking to join. You, idols. A new recruit? Well, come on in. Go find Cheryl, with a snake mask. She'll hook you up. Hi, Cheryl. I'm thinking about joining the idols. Yeah! Ready to take down the establishment? Sure. By, like, stealing car parts and shit. Or by punching everybody in the neck till they choke! <laughs> but hey, you do you. The idols are a big tent. You like heists? Talk to Martin. He's headbanging around somewhere. You Martin? Heard you were a heist man. Fuck yeah! I made this botnet that hacks Wi-Fi-enabled refrigerators. Come summer, there won't be a working ice dispenser in town. Sounds great for the little guy. But do you steal real things? Like car parts? What even is real in a late-stage capitalist digital economy? Boom. Mind blown. But if you like meat space theft, talk to Timmy O. He's around somewhere working on his bike. Timmy O. Heard you bring in big hauls. Anything that ain't nailed down. Just boosted a shipment of car parts off some cog in the big auto machine. Oh, crazy. Where would you even keep something like that? Warehouse and back, with the other refuse of materialism. Told Kev I'd try to play nice. Stop! What are you doing here? I heard you have some car parts I was hoping to take back. Fuck off! Thing is, they belong to one of the little guys you say you fight for, so... There are no little guys. Just idols and tools of the system. That was fucking brutal! You won't hit me for that! Ah! code, I'm in for a lot of long. I'm taking those parts. Have to tether that container and drag it back to JR.
too easy. Shit, you actually did it. Now I can finally build my garage. I always deliver on a job. Hang on. Kev? What's up? You said you'd be nice to them. I was. They were shitheads. Well, now they want you dead, and they're headed your way. Shit. Thanks for the heads up. JR, we got idols coming. Those some bitches are back. Time to beat some asses. <laughs> That's over. Thanks for saving my business. No problem. Thanks for the percentage. Now all I need to do is build a garage. How's that gonna work? Just you watch. Here it is. The world premiere grand opening of Jim Rob's garage. The service center has all the tools you need to customize your ride. And if you see a car out there with something you like, bring it on in. Now that we're in business, let's talk shop. Hey, JR, if we're short on parts, why don't we just steal them? We could run a little chop shop here. Now that would save us a pretty penny. I need some parts for a hammerhead. How about you get me one of those? Almost time for a workout! I should take this over to JR. Hey, JR, I got you a hammerhead. All right, just leave it there on the side. What else you need? The idols have an off-road buggy they call the Desert Devil. Can you get that for me? I've seen them riding northeast of town around the bases. If it's out there, I'll find it.
Bye. Even it's strange. Got it. Let's get this back to JR. Just what JR wanted. Ugh, I'm bringing you down. News flash Santo Ileso. Members of the gang Los Panteros were arrested for antiquity smuggling after a truckload of stolen artifacts was intercepted in the desert outside Santo Ileso. Among the items recovered was the long lost Hummingbird Codex. Dr. Antonio Espina of the Museum of Santo Ileso plans to unveil the ancient Aztec treasure at an upcoming gala. Juana Villalobos, Star Registered News Network. Here's your buggy. Much obliged. What's next? How about an attrazione? That's not an easy car to find. Well, it just so happens I got a particular one in mind. It belongs to Levi Marshall. Marshall as in Atticus? His nephew. That little turd caused me grief to no end during his summer internship. He's a student at that fancy art school in Marina del Lago. Gotcha. I'll check the parking lot next time I'm over there.
out. I should drive this over to Jim Robs. Here you go. Not even a scratch. That's what I like to hear. How about finding me a go-kart? Seriously? Serious as a grave. Well, there's a kart track over in El Dorado. I'll check around there. Can you give me lucky number seven? It's got the kneecappers. Lucky number seven, huh? I'll see what I can do. Newsflash, Santo Ileso. Officials are warning. This doesn't concern you. Keeping it strange.
check this out. I can put this to good use. Look what I found. I gotta say, totally agree with you. Should I try some block with a higher SP? Hey! Free bike! I've had enough of this! Jackpot. It's mine now. Ah! They'll think twice about their customers only bathroom policy. Check this out. from Jim Robs. Dateline, sound right Good news for hired killers. The Wanted app now offers a convenient way for users to safely and anonymously settle scores bury the hatchet in the necks of their enemies. But some freelance operatives are concerned that this new gig economy could be bad for their profession and the murder industry as a whole. Wanted is now ranked number five among free apps. Star Register News Network, Juana Villalobos reporting. Where do you want the cart? Usual spot's fine. I think you can get me a custom 1995 Audubon Courser Special Edition. It has to be yellow. Sounds like you've got one in mind? Just so happens there's a car fitting that description over by the hydroelectric dam. Belongs to one of the engineers. Are we settling another score? Maybe. Remind me to stay on your good side. Great! I can't believe 
be responsible for what my face does when y'all talk. Jackpot. I can put this to good use. Looky here. Thanks. Bye. I am cool. Sweet. I always had it. Looks good. Good eye.
now. I should take this over to JR. I do for you. Here's that car you asked for. Thank you kindly. How'd you like to take it up a notch? What do you mean? Los Panteros has a monster truck. Think you can get your hands on it? Why the hell not? It's mine now. Cha-ching! Hey.
taking you down! Eat it! Let's get this back to JR. Back with a monster truck. Hot damn. You know Reggie Sanborn? The smelter's running back? That's the one. He's got a sporty little crisis I'd love to get my hands on. So, are we just stealing cars you want, or do we actually need them for parts? Don't see why we can't do both. Anyhow, I reckon he'll find that car down by the smelter dome. Interesting. Dateline, Santo Ileso. Investigation continues into the armed robbery of Big Vig's payday loans in Mercado. It was the sixth predatory lender to be robbed in as many months. Officials say the incidents could be related. This has been Juana Villalobos, reporting for the Star Register News Network.
Fighting go. Yeah, too easy. I should drive this over to Jim Robs. Still got it. there. I always had it. JR, I got something for you. Outstanding. Now, how about a fertile lance? You have expensive taste. You don't know the half of it. I heard this car is a prototype for a flying automobile. Now you're just making shit up. Well, it don't fly yet, but I'd sure like to have a look-see. You'll find it parked outside a house in Monta Vista. Jackpot. Is it over yet? It's mine now. Let's 
sweet. Just what I wanted. from Jim Robs. Already? Here's that fur de lance, JR. Oh boy. You know the Pulaski Bay Bridge project? North of Lakeshore? What about it? Well, the developer's got himself a bright red phoenix. Sounds like you made some unusual modifications. I'll check it out next time I'm over there. Never listen to me.
Looky here. Look what I found. Nice pick. Love the view. Let's get this back to JR.
Stop right there! Here's the Phoenix. Hope it wasn't too much trouble. Say, you, uh, remember Sal from Marshall? Uh, nope. Well, she's in a pickle. Got herself in a bang-up the other day and messed up her APC real good. Marshall can't fix it? You know how they get at the motor pool. She's already on the shit list. You're a stand-up guy, JR. That I am. They keep an APC over by the prison northwest of Lakeshore. The frontier, huh? I'll give it a shot.
Just make sure. Good eye. Shoot to kill. Nice one. Just what I wanted. Oh, God. Nice one. I should drive this over to Jim Robs.
Here you go, JR. One Marshall APC. Just like old times. Remember how Gwen used to say, let's get paid? I'm pretty sure this is not what she had in mind. Well, what you don't know won't hurt us. How about we have another company meet? Well, if it ain't my partner in crime. How's our business? Your chop shop idea saved us a bundle in parts. Nothing left to do but counter money. All in a day's work. about to start for the Hummingbird Codex unveiling. I want your security team in place. It's your night to shine. All right, team. Tonight's a big night, so nobody fuck it up. You, uh, uh, Johnson. How's the Codex? Ready for its entrance? Roger that. It's in position, and the display case hover tech is green. Good. I love this tech. Thank you for coming here this I'm gonna evening. check in with the boss. We Antonio's are speech should be wrapping up. Bravo, team. How's it hanging? Uh, now, fine. The Hummingbird Codex holds... I saw that. <laughs> Just kidding. Relax. 30 years ago, and of course, I was a young thanks to each and every one of you, Mexico City. your donations tonight will benefit the international effort to end illegal traffic of stolen antiquities. Mr. Marshall, how was your evening, sir? Fine, fine. But I don't see our guest of honor. Where's my hummingbird codex? They'll be escorting it in any moment. That's what I like to hear. Have you met Myra Starr? She's on the Marshall Board of Directors. How do you do, ma'am? Quite well. So, you're Atticus's new hotshot. That's what it says on my ID badge. Oh, talented and confident. Reminds me of a younger me. Now, nah, what say we celebrate? Go get yourself a drink. Yes, sir. This gal is not as exclusive as I would have liked. What do you think you're doing? You don't drink on duty. I'm following orders. Atticus told me to celebrate. <laughs> of course he did. You want a word of advice? Watch your step around Atticus. He only sees results. No problem. 
That's what I give him. Uh-huh. Hey, what happened to not drinking on duty? I'm not on duty. When are they bringing the Codex out? Hey, Nina. I'm on the job right now. That's why I'm calling. Los Panteros are about to try to take the Codex back. What? Are you sure? Yes, I'm driving getaway. I'd have called sooner, but I wasn't alone. Fuck. When? Nina, get off your phone. We're going in. Shit! You glad you had that drink now? Maybe. Ah. Where's the Sergio? The turtles. Bring me the codex. Everyone else, stay the fuck out of my way. Oh, Got a security breach. Panteros are in the Paleolithic exhibit. Panteros on level three. Increase the guard on the codex. Oh! Where is my head of security? Right here, Mr. Marshall. Get this under control. It's an embarrassment to the company. Right away, sir. Ah! Oh! Marshall, cover! No! No. Get the codex. I'll get Atticus out of here. Hey, I'm in charge here. You get Atticus out of here, I'll secure the codex. Uh-huh. Cretaceous exhibit. Someone get eyes on the codex. You nuts! That place is full of Panteros! It's faster. I can handle them. The idols have come to save you from yourselves. Make no mistake, we will take the Codex. We will kill you all. We will bring the gift of anarchy to Santo Eliso. We are the idols. Fear us. Heads up, Kev. What happened to the roommate code? Do that. Oh! What? Fine monument to greed. The oppressors drink and laugh while the enslaved clean up their table scraps. Your so called society. It's a failed experiment. It's time to put it to an end. Time to wash it away. Time to make some noise. Get ready for a whole new world with no pharaohs, no gods, no idols, but us. Damn it, the idols are here too! There's too many of them! We lost Perkins! Come with me if you want to stay alive. We need backup! The idols are everywhere! Jesus Christ, these psychos keep coming! I'm almost at the Codex. Anyone got eyes on it? The idols are in the Codex room. I'm trying to... Fun times. Shake that poop out your pants and follow me.
Get the fuck away from there! I'll show you up! I'm good. Gwen, I've got the codex. I've secured Atticus. I need to find the rest of the board. I'll get the codex to the safe room. How the fuck do I move it? Your martial ID triggers the sensor. It'll move on its own as long as you stay close. Got it. Access granted. Emergency transport initiated. Hover systems re-engaging. Haha! <laughs> Get her done! Too easy. Room. I need backup. This thing's getting buggy. Cover systems re-engaging. What the fuck? Blow it! Waiting for escort. Codex is still up there. Fucking hover tech. Somebody report. I got separated from the Codex. Anyone have eyes on it? Negative. I got nothing. It's just chaos here. Damn it. Door's blocked. Need something to bust through that gate. Busted RPG? No fixing that. Rocket? Need something to fire it with. I have an idea. You're alive. Don't celebrate yet. Virgil got away. I got most of the board locked down, but I can't find my star. Copy. I'll keep an eye out for her. Mini gun? Ah! Ah! 
happy with that. Oh god, it's you. Better find cover. I'll hold him off. Start running if you want to live. Fun time. No fucking way am I letting Sergio take that codex back. out miss star it's safe thank you thank you so much you are really good at this it's not my first time shooting up a place with a minigun ma'am just the first time people are happy i did it how the fuck did this happen shit what's going on sir you sir i know i made a little mess protecting the museum but we have to look at the big picture the threat's been neutralized, Miss Star is safe, and as you can see, the Codex is secure. A mess? Yes, there is a goddamn mess! I don't... I don't understand. Well, you were wasting time with her. The Idol stole the Codex and replaced it with a fake! Sir, I wasn't wasting time, I was saving... Do you think I give a shit if Myra Star lives or dies? Atticus. You are replaceable. You are replaceable. That was not. Sir, I can lead a team to retrieve the Codex. The hell you can. You're fired. What? You're done. If I see you on Marshall property again, I'll have you shot. We'll make this right, Antonio. I promise. Thank you. I am sorry. I just got word that the idols are planning on attacking the museum. Hey. It's Kev. I, uh, I made your breakfast if you want some. That's cool if you don't. Nina wasn't hungry either. I'm sorry about last night. I didn't hear about the museum until it was too late to warn you. The Collective don't tell me shit. You should come to the Idols party with Eli and I later. Open bar? No? Okay, uh, I'm gonna go. Just, uh... Just know that Eli and I are worried about you guys. Later. Looks like we both got fucked over. Yeah. No work today? I'm leaving Sergio's group text on red. Fair. Los Panteros have been going downhill since he started leading. 
It used to be about family. Now it's all about him. Plus, he's zero for two this week. That just makes him pissy. I want to eat my feelings. Come the fuck on. God damn it. Stupid refurbished appliances. Figures? to the cutting room, the premier auction experience for knife connoisseurs of all ages. Our first stop, Lung Piercer. A contemporary update on the classic Shiv, the Lung Piercer. Looks like we got a shopper in Santa Aliso that knows their stabbing implements. Let's bring out the next item. It's been a hell of a day here on the cutting room, but I've been saving the best for last. The Judas 3000. If Brutus had had one of these bad boys, he wouldn't have needed the Senate to help stab Caesar. How many knives did you end up buying? Not enough. Hey, Sergio just texted us. <laughs> he has to be pretty pissed. Yeah, says he's planning on attacking the idols party. Man, I'd hate to be the idols right now. Everyone at that party is probably gonna get killed. Sucks to be Kevin Eli. Yeah. Oh shit! We gotta go. They're not coming, are they? They'll get over it, man. Don't worry about it. <sighs> They're totally pissed at me. They'll get over it. Give them time. You mind if I get a drink? You do you, man. Can I have a white wine spritzer? You okay? I, I I don't think so. Get in and drive fast. Where's the party? The resort. We gotta move. Try to get a hold of Eli. I'm gonna call Kev. Come on. You picking up? Nothing. You? No. Fuck. No, I got voicemail. My phone's on Same silent, here. so leave a message after I drop the beep. Wait for it. Wait for it. Kev, call me. I'm gonna call Sergio. Maybe I can put a stop to this. He'll never listen. It's worth a try. Well, no cool deciding to get back to me. Sergio, you gotta call this off. My friends are in there. I'm the friend you should be worried about. You are taking Los Panteros to war just because you think Marshall and the Idols embarrassed you. You're saying some shit you're gonna regret, Nina. Call it off or I quit. You ain't gonna quit. Try me. Great, Eli. Stay cool. Where are you guys? Eli's behind the bar. I'm keeping him covered. Nina and I are on our way. Keep Eli alive. Got it. Please don't hang up. Eli, listen to me. Nina and I are gonna kill every motherfucker standing between us and you. And that means we're gonna need both hands, okay? Okay. You're gonna be fine. I promise. Shit, the 
Montero's group chat is blowing up. They set up roadblocks on the bridges. We're gonna have to go through your crew, Nina. Los Panteros aren't my crew anymore. Eli and Kev are all that matters. The last thing I said to Eli was, I'll be late on rent. The last thing I said to Kevin was, ugh. Everything's fine. They're gonna be fine. Running out the clock with a celebration of synthwave. You ready? Let's get our boys back home. We're coming in from the side. Still got it. Oh, Nina, she's turned on us. No, Los Panteros turned on me. What's right there? They're here. We're gonna get you out, but you'll have to walk. Oh. I'll try. Shit. Shit? Shit what? What now? Los Panteros should have left the party crashing to the experts. like you're gonna back the fuck off. No, 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 no! They're cool, they're with me. If they're with you, then you get to kill them. I guess this is my last idol's party. You don't need this fucking cult anyway, Kev. What she said. Let's finish what you started and get Eli out of here. Yes, please! Never knew you were getting out of here! Not in one piece! Too bad! Check you yourself! Guess we're all quitting today. I didn't love a good time. I realize what a sick fuck is you. And your friends are obsolete. Okay, Eli, let's go. Oh man, we're in the shit now. We just pissed off the idols and those Panteros. Yeah, big time. So let's not stick around until they come back. Agreed, let's move. And this time, I'm driving. Sometimes. Take that! 
that truck. Better acceleration. Oh, what about the gas mileage? Fuck the gas mileage! After us. That's it. I've had enough for one day. Keep driving. I'm gonna teach these fuckers a lesson. You sir, you got them coming up fast. Well, I got an RPG and some shit to work out. Let's see how that goes for us. I'm good. I don't want to die before I make my first million. You're not gonna die. I got you, buddy. Eli. We're almost out of this. Full of adversity and challenges. But if you want to learn, instead of getting cut from someone else, what do you do? These fuckers are relentless. I know how to lose them. Hey, look. Your friends deserve better. You deserve better. You are more than a cog in a corporate machine. You are not the boss. Hang on. To death for your useless degree. If your life is stuck in neutral, there's only uh, one. Nina? Why aren't we at the hospital? Because you don't have insurance. I don't really care. What if you saw what they charged to fix a flesh wound? Kev, where's the... Hall closet, no, top shelf. Okay, this is gonna suck, buddy. Oh, fuck! You're doing great. You're being very brave. Fuck you. Hey, keep talking to Kev like that, and you won't get a star on the star chart. <laughs> Ow! Oh, what are we gonna do? Finish sewing you up? Yeah, and then what? The Idols and Panteros aren't exactly our number one fans right now. Isn't that obvious? We're starting a criminal empire. What? Your car was right, Eli. About everything. Yeah, what the fuck is happening? Guys, we're really good at what we do. So why are we doing it for other people and not ourselves? I mean, you know how to start a business. Kev knows how to get attention. <laughs> I'm a walking murder party. And Nina? Nina's the best goddamn driver in the business. Who could touch us? Hell, we just took on two crews at once and walked away just fine. I was shot. And you're getting a sticker, so quit bitching. I'm in. Fuck yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Eli? Guys, this is a little crazy. What happened to there being a difference between surviving and thriving? Well, I survived being shot, and now I want to thrive without being shot again. Nina's down. Kev's down. Snickerdoodle is definitely down. Oh, do not bring her into this. Eli, this cat suffers no fools. <laughs> and neither should you. Uh. <laughs> is that a yes? Yeah, it's a yes. It's our time now. Let's get this shit started. This isn't so bad.
Hey, just a reminder, we're having our first company meeting in a bit. Don't be late. Company meeting? Nice euphemism. I'll be right there. I don't know, guys. What do you think? I feel like there's a lot we're missing. There is, but it's enough to go on for now. What about criminals? Don't we kind of need more than three if we want to call this thing an empire? There's four of us. Oh, are you planning on shooting anyone? After that party, I think I'll stick to metaphorical blood on my hands. Yeah, that's less useful when people try to kill us. Nina's right. We need more people. We'll look more legit if we have a home base. You saying we're not legit already? Oh, I love you, but I'm allergic. <clears throat> yeah, point taken. All right, let's brainstorm. What would our place need? I gotta be able to host some parties and have more than a fucking galley kitchen to work with. I wanna be able to set up a proper garage to work in. I don't think Sergio's gonna be letting me near the forge anytime soon. That's good. What you got? I don't know, a ball pit? I'm joking. Kind of, I'm kind of joking. It needs to be defensible. We pissed off a lot of people, and let's not kid ourselves, they're gonna try to kill us. You're fun. Hey man, just being real. For me? We need it to be cheap. We don't have a lot of cash, so... We'll probably be looking at a fixer-upper. So, we need an open space for the interior, a decent plot of land to build a garage, it's gotta hold up in a firefight, and it's gotta be dirt cheap. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, it's gonna be a bitch fine. I got it! Holy shit, we are so good at this. There's an old church. Near Fort Cullen. The sanctuary is huge. I can turn the rectory into a garage. It's condemned so it's cheap. And it's got a fucking graveyard so we can stash the bodies. You fucking rock. What are we waiting for? Let's check this place out. Let's go. I'll drive. Where is this church? Up on 3rd. Oh, that place. Guys, look at these pictures. The architectural details look amazing. I see. Nina, this place is in ruins. I said it was a fixer-upper. There's a fine line between fixer-upper and money pit. Relax. The listing says it's being restored by a developer. John Bland. John Bland? The real estate king of Santo Elisa? See the guy on all those billboards? Why does a guy that into self-promotion stick with a name like Bland? Bland is no Roger McGillicott. He does restore the place, and we can still get it for cheap. It might work out. Assuming the restorations preserve the original facade. You're not gonna worry about preservation when I put in my state-of-the-art kitchen, are you? We can discuss that later. That's a lot of heavy equipment for a renovation. Looks more like a demolition crew. He's gonna restore this place in the condos. Not if we do something about it. Cannons, who wants to demo a demo crew? Like the drivetrain overheated. Guess it wasn't designed with you in mind. Marshall's down, but they'll be back as long as Bland owns the deed to the property. Then let's get into cell. After this? Not likely. 
Then we'll shake him down and make him hand it over. The idols used to do stuff like that all the time. Good call. Kev, you're with me. Where's Bland even at? Let's call the number on all those billboards and find out. Bland here. One sec. Mr. Mayor, an honor talking to you. Sounds like he's at City Hall. All right, who's this? Mr. Bland? I'm calling to take that old mission shirt off your hands. Wait, are you the asshole who just wrecked my demolition site? Listen, fuck nut. You set foot on one of my properties again. I'll make sure you can't buy so much as a tool shed in this town. Well, that was uncalled for. Eh, let's go take his ass for a little ride. Hey, hey. Is that him in that car? Same dickish face as the billboards. Hi there, me again. You gonna make this easy and give me the deed to the church? You? Go fuck yourself. Bad answer, John. Hope you don't get carsick. Let's show this shitbag a little Santo Eliso drift. Whoa, 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 whoa! What are you doing? What are you, crazy? Yeah, John, we are. Now give us the D. No way! Okay, guess we're gonna have to play hardball. Where are you taking me? I told you to play hardball in traffic. This is how you do business? That's right, man, we're local. Just give us the deed. No. Guess the ride's not over yet. Final offer, John. You're not leaving here unless we get what we want. Think you can handle a little airtime? Holy fuck! Pleasure doing business with you. This car is also ours now, too, so get the fuck out. That worked great! We got the deed and a briefcase. Yeah, plus we blew up some shit, did some sick drifts, and, uh, stole the church. All in a day's work. Ready to head home? Home? I like the sound of that. Ooh, I'm gonna post about it. Yada yada da, yada da da. Hashtag take me to church, hashtag new digs who this, hashtag list. And posted. Oh look, I already got a like. Seriously? How many followers do you have there? DJ Kev has his fans. Marshall backed off. You get the deed? Yep, we got the dude's whole briefcase. Let's get inside. You got the keys? Keys? No. Just the briefcase. No problem. I'm sure I can get in through a window or something and open it up. Why don't we just break down a door? Uh, not my door. Whoa, calm down, Dad. Do you know how much a door costs? We own this place. We have to pay for that shit. Nina was right. This place is awesome. Hey, check it out! Cool graveyard! Yeah! Hang on, I'm getting a call! Oh, shit. You better hear this. Hi, Kevy. We saw your post. Congrats on the new dicks. We adore your takedown of that gentrifying dick! Who is that? The Collective. The Idols want to throw you a housewarming party. Fuck. 
Their parties get violent. No thanks. I wasn't asking. Duh. <laughs> See you soon, Kevin. Uh... I'll get the door. Hang tight. We've got company coming. Have you seen what's in this briefcase? Not now, Eli. Get inside. And maybe revisit your stance on guns. You got a place to say your prayers. Some backup in the graveyard. I'm coming, Kev. Kev doesn't want you. Get over it. you, Eli. A housewarming. Guess all that's left to do is check out the new digs. Yeah, okay. Dead bodies notwithstanding, this place is pretty great. Right? There's a lot of potential here. A lot of work to do, but still. We're actually gonna do this, aren't we? You goddamn right we are. At least we've got a cool logo. I'll take it off the whiteboard. We need a name. The Saints. We call ourselves the Saints. This place has so much potential. I can't wait to decorate. I've got a list of stuff that'll really complete the vibe, you know? We don't exactly have the budget for home decor right now. No problem. There's a nice cheap way. Come with me to Fort Cullen and I'll show you. 
There's a bunch of cool collectibles around town that would look amazing in the church. All we have to do is find a thing we want, snap a picture, and boom, it'll just show up there. Really? How does that work? It works. Yeah, but how? It just works? I don't overthink it. Do you know someone with, like, a 3D printer or something? I do, actually. Remember Teddy? Your ex? The guy with the ponytail? Other ex, Teddy. The woman with the mohawk? Right, so here's how it works. I think the Western Golden Cannon would rock at the church. Just take a picture of it. All right, let's head back and see what we got. So, Teddy, she was cool. She still is. I was thinking maybe next time we do a karaoke night, I'll invite her. Unless she's back with Melissa, of course. Ugh, Melissa. She has a good heart. Oh, how about we put the cannon here? Nice. That looks badass. Keep a lookout for the rest of the shit on that list, huh? This place has so much potential. Hey, Eli. What's up? I hereby invite you to the inaugural meeting of the Saints Board of Directors. Oh. Uh, that sounds pretty corporate structure-y. It'll be donuts. On my way. Okay. So we got the name, we got the home base, we got the logo. So that means next step is to find people that can shoot guns? No. Uh, so that means next step is to make connections with the people that can shoot guns. Oh, come on, man. We want this thing to be more than a street gang. We want to be an organization, an institution. And that means we need to have our fingers in more pies. You got an idea where to start? As a matter of fact, I do. Okay. Everyone's action item is to reach out to their contacts and see what new business opportunities you can find for the Saints. Shit, my contacts all have their own things going already. What about JR? Your partner's on his garage, right? Maybe he'll go all in with the Saints? Couldn't hurt to ask. Great. What about you, Nina? I can't talk to any of my old Panteros contacts. But I do know some people who did business with them. I'm sure I can persuade them to do business with us instead. Nice. Kevin, <laughs> you want contacts? I got contacts, baby. Okay, go be superstars. Meantime, I'm gonna finish going through that briefcase we got from John Bland. That thing's a treasure trove, let me tell you. Everyone, keep me posted on your progress. I'd like to be part of something big. My friends and I are starting a new venture. Sounds awful nice, but our current venture's in trouble. Those Panteros are cutting into our profits something fierce. I'll tell you what. Join our new thing, and no one's ever gonna mess with this garage again. Well, you take care of this Panteros problem, and I'll consider it. Deal. Beat your ass! 
Jim Rob's garage is off limits. Show your face there again, you're dead. The old man sent you? You mess with JR, you mess with us. Fail. Saints protect what is ours. Howdy. Hey, JR. I took care of the crew in the park. Well, I'll be. Let's go after their supply lines next. Derek's got a crew at the train depot smuggling in crates of stolen parts. That's how they keep undercutting my prices. Don't worry. I've got this. They're being blown to cars, too. Panteros get real bugged by that. Hey, Eli. I'm cleaning up a Panteros problem for JR, and then I think he's in. How's the rest of the team doing? Great. Kevin knows so many people. <laughs> that all he has to do is buy him coffee to get him to sign on. Well, I'm busting my ass torching Fantero's cars. Come on. You know you love it. I really do. Your territory, dumbass! It is now. You fuck with Jim Rob, you answer to the Saints. Oh. Oh. You can't even lift this! times. Sergio, Jim Rob's garage is under the Saints' protection. Jim Rob's. Two for two, JR. Son of a gun, you still got it. The only thing left to hit is Derek's HQ. It's down on the corner. Oh, hell's bells. You gotta get back here. Derek and his crew just rolled up on me. This is what you get for fighting back, old man. You get off of my land. Fuck. Better hurry.
I'm gonna say this one last time. Stay away from JR. Still got it. That settles Derek and his crew. Brought thoughtful of them to bring the fight to us. So, what should I tell my friends? Are you in? I'm in. What do you call this new outfit? We're the Saints. Welcome aboard. Well, we can count JR in. Uh, what is this? It's not board game night. No, this is where all our dreams come true. Don't say that. My dreams are pretty weird. While you were out talking to JR, I was going through the briefcase we got from John Bland, the real estate guy. Turns out the deeds of the church wasn't the only thing in there. As of now, we are the proud owners of a shit ton of empty lots all across town. That's real estate we can use to start up some new, um, entrepreneurial ventures. By which he means crimes. Fine, yes, crimes. Nice. You did say we need to have our fingers in more pies. I've got that covered. I spent the whole day baking my ass off. Okay, fine. They're empanadas. That's not a pie. It's in the pie family. Now I'm really hungry. Plan first, eat later. Right, so... How do we cover all this ground? One building at a time. So far, we've got the church. And Jim Robs. So what do we build next? Whatever we want. Shady Oaks Medical Clinic. Now I know what you're thinking. None of us have medical degrees, but that's okay. Because the whole thing is a front, see? We just have to look legit enough for insurance companies to pay us lots of money for fraudulent claims. Now here's my friend Tamira. She knows all the angles of the insurance game. Go talk to her, and she'll help us get the ball rolling. Hey, Tamira. Welcome aboard. You ready to get to work? Sure am. My automated claim generation code is ready for beta testing. What's that now? It produces fake records and documents based on real world data. It should be good enough to fool the fraud detection algorithms. That sounds really complicated. How about I just throw myself in front of cars and trucks? And the harder they hit me, the more money we get. Sure, if you want to die. With my system, all we got to do is push a button. How about I do insurance fraud my way and you do it your way? You're the boss. Just be careful out there.
Not liking this. Friends don't let friends do stupid things alone. Yoga teacher gave me an F. Dang, population. This is just not my day. Perfect. You better walk the other way. I should do this more often. One of these days, I'm gonna go back to school. Cha-ching! Enjoying this. Looky here. I heard about those guys. They're new. They're so Look what I found. Lucky day. Your Mine. Idol's gonna rewrite the script, and you're gonna land on the cutting room. Like camera. Showtime.
that's one. I heard they took over the old church. Interesting. Society corrupts everything. Walk away while Let's you get can. Them. Just what I wanted. This is Roxy Pipkin, and you're listening to KFBZZ 103.3 Overdrive.
Thanks for this. That's a keeper. You're going my way. Stop. Nice pick. Got it. Move it. Look what I found. Thanks for warming the seat for me. Shady Oaks Medical Clinic. Hey, Tamira. I found a great spot to fake some injuries. You know you don't have to do this, right? Just get the forms ready. We're about to make a lot of money. Be 
Keep it up. Oof. Tamira, this is totally going to work. Until I have to drive down there and scrape your ass up with a shovel. Five more runs like this, and we're golden. These saints don't look religious to me.
Dateline. Santo Ileso. Economists report a 22% surge in new construction this quarter. A positive sign for the Santo Ileso economy. And 15% more... <laughs> 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 According to the Cavanaugh County Chamber... Shady Oaks, Tamira speaking. You ready with the paperwork? I'm about to have an accident. Oh, that, that sounded wrong. Don't make a mess. I need a vacation.
time has become an irrelevant concept to me. Bingo. Finders keepers. Check this out. I need this more than you. Shady Oaks. Hey, Tamira. I'm feeling really good about this spot. People drive like maniacs here. You know, boss, you could just take the day off and let me handle this. Nah, that feels like cheating. I saw it tomorrow.
Shady Oaks for shady folks. Aw, that's catchy. And true. Oh, hi, boss. Can I take off this doctor costume? It's got blood all over it. We need a doctor. It's a medical clinic. But I'm not a doctor. You don't have to be a doctor. Just look like one. Wow. Wonder if they say it's a
down. Fun times. Looks good.
bad habit. Hey, I told you those colors don't mix. Don't blame me. I can put this to good use. It's mine now. Jackpot. Where did the saints even come from? Surprise, surprise. It's my lucky day. I'll do. How can it be so damn hot every day? Shady Oaks. Hey, Tamira. I'm gonna take another hit for the team. How are you not dead yet? I don't know. Just lucky, I guess.
got a gang problem. Line. Santo, Ileso. Investigation continues into the theft of the Hummingbird Codex, stolen from the Museum of Santo Ileso, despite security provided by Marshall Defense Industries. Although witnesses report the presence of both Los Panteros and the Idols on the night of the burglary, officials have no leads indicating the current work. Shady Oaks Medical Clinic. We are unable to take your call right now, but uh, I'll just tell her about it later.
get in my steps.
Hey, boss, we just got a big fat check for all those times you played in traffic. I seriously did not think that that plan of yours would work. See? Simple and painless. How about you stop by the clinic next time you're in the neighborhood? I should run for city council. Welcome back. You look pretty good for someone who got run over like a hundred times. What's up, Eli? Meet me at the church. It's time to address our staffing needs. On my way. So, how do we staff up? Easy. I've got a 14-step plan. That sounds about 13 steps too long. Yeah. Why not just go to Boot Hill and show everyone what a badass you are? What's Boot Hill? Are you kidding me? Check out the laptop. Okay. Boot Hill is this live stream fight club kind of thing they do on the abandoned island out in the lake. This sick cat named Doc Ketchum runs the show. Fight club? More like murder circus. We need to recruit more saints, right? Everyone in town with a criminal record watches this live stream. Oh, he's right. I've seen Pantero streaming it. I just didn't know what it was called. But it's crazy dangerous. It's viral marketing. Viral marketing is not supposed to come with a mortality rate. It's like breaking out in the art world. You gotta do something to capture people's attention. This does. Plus it nails our target demographic. I don't know. You're the one who have to do this. What do you think? Y'all had me at Murder Circus. You sure? We cannot afford to lose you. Also, you're our friend. We'd miss you. Ah, don't worry. I was born for this. Sweet. There's a ferry to the island that docks out back. We can do this whenever you're ready.
Let's go join the murder circus.
God damn. Jesus Christ. So that's what being good at murder means. I know. Seeing it on a leaderboard really puts things in perspective. Should we be scared or reassured? Why not both? Eli, mute your fucking phone. Oh, yeah. Holy shit. Holy shit. These just keep coming in. Who are they from? People who are watching, they, they want to learn from the master. You know what that means. We got recruits? We got recruits. We got recruits!
How's it hanging, boss? All right, so here's the plan. We open a monster taqueria and call it Jalupa Cabra. But we don't just sell food. We take over the entire drug distribution network in Santo Ileso. Here, it's all about the food trucks. My friend Chewy knows the business inside and out. And he makes a killer michelada. He'll show you how it works. All the traffic in town moves through four trucks. Weenie, Twisty, Sammy, and the King. Nothing a few rockets and a Molotov can't fix. True. Or we could steal each truck and all its product and put it to work for us. Even better. Where do these guys roll? I've got Jimmy following the King right now. I'll put you in touch. Dateline, Santo, Ileso. Police have dismissed allegations that the Ketchum family is live streaming a secret murder circus from their abandoned factory compound on New Birmingham Island. Lawyers for the Ketchum family noted the island is private property and not open to the public. Trespassers will be prosecuted. Juana Villalobos, Star Register News Network. It's Jimmy, right? Yeah. Good to see you, boss. What's the king moving today? Lower dust. They just re-upped, so the truck's full. You see any muscle? Maybe a dozen guys. A few cars. I'll take it from here. Go see if Chewie needs help. Here we go. They had no chance.
I'm good. Nice one. Hey, Chewie. I'm driving home with the king. Oh, yeah. That's Lakeshore money. All those bankers and brokers are gonna make us rich. there. Okay, boss. Bring in the king and finish his crew. We gotta lock this place down tight. Ah! Yeah, too easy. Where's the crown now, King?
Don't risk your life for this. Oh, hey boss! <laughs> Weenie's running their weekly psychedelic special. A big shipment just arrived from Peru. Peru, huh? Who's minding the store? Winnie's got soldiers all over the east side. As soon as you pull that trigger, it's gonna be war. I hope you're right. Want some backup? I'm good. You go on home. Bring it on, Weenie. Chalupa Cabra owns this town. Nice one. with that. No surprise there. Chewie, I've got Weenie. We're coming in hot. Oh, fuck yeah! That gives us the holy side. We're in the money now, boss. Truck in, keep Weenie's crew out. Diggity dog. We did it. Well, the Saints don't seem too bad.
You never listen to me. I can't keep doing this. That'll do. Bacteria is the only thing. Hey, Lou, what's the scoop? Twisty runs the market here in the flats. They deal in soft-serve ice cream and stolen pharmaceuticals. Who's playing defense? Not sure. Whoever they are, keep it quiet. Not for long. Why don't you get out of here? I'm coming for you, Twisty. Ah! Ah! Yeah, too easy. Hey, Chewy, want some ice cream? Oh, man, you got twisty? That puts us in the flats. Shopping malls, big box stores, the fucking smelter dome. We got it made. Watch out for Twisty's crew. Park the truck in our lot and finish them off.
Twisty's turf is our turf now. Video game streamer career is gonna take off. I could do this forever. Is that the Saints? Get the fuck out of there! Secure the back. Being alone is so that's Sammy, huh? Oh, hey, boss. Where's Kev? Busy. What do you got for me? Sammy runs the northeast part of town. Ponta Vista, Marina. They sell club drugs mostly. High end synthetics. How's security? You should have brought Kev. I can handle this. You better go. This is gonna be fun. Always had it.
Nice one. Sammy are heading your way. God damn! You know what that means? We've got Monte Vista and Marina del Lago.
Boss, we gotta hustle. Park Sammy in the lawn and take out his crew. Sammy's done in this town. That's the last one. Why don't you come on over and we'll talk? We've got product, we've got customers, now we've got trucks in every corner of Santo Ileso. We are in business. Gorgeous. Not good.
about the same. Fucking loser. Do not catch me. Stay the hell out of that federal city. Oh, no 
chance. Just basic economics. Nice to see you. Okay, look. There's nothing cool about toxic waste. It's gross. It's probably gonna kill you, but that green stuff's gonna make us rich. The big companies drive their toxic waste here and pay us big bucks by the barrel. Then we dump it on the cheap. Now, my man with the plan is Jersey Dan. He did time for this kind of shit, so he knows what he's talking about. He'll fill you in. Dan, where are the trucks? Well, turns out we gotta get the trucks ourselves. What? Why don't the customers bring them here? Our customers are respectable captains of industry. They don't want to be associated with the likes of us. Then fuck them. Now hear me out. For an additional transport fee, I arrange to have them leave the trucks at places around the city. All you gotta do is drive them here. Fine. I'll get the trucks. And that's how you lead by example. I put the first one on the map for you. future disposal. Dan, there's no truck here. What do you mean there's no truck? Are you at the right place? Yes, there's a busted up barrel and some green stuff, but no truck. I don't know what to tell you. It's got to be around there somewhere. Fine. I'll have a look around. Don't touch the green stuff. Dan, it's me. I found the truck. Oh, that's great. Bring her on in. This transport fee better be worth it. Oh, trust me. We got a sweetheart deal. The barrels don't seem very secure back there. Yeah, you gotta be super, super careful. That shit is volatile. But as long as the barrels don't leak, you're fine. And what if they leak? Then you better haul ass on down here so we can dump those barrels fast. Either that or say your prayers, I guess.
Just leave her right there, boss. Those orders keep rolling in. I'll update the map with all the new locations. Is it safe to have all that toxic waste just out there in the city? Oh, no, not at all. That stuff can turn people into radioactive homicidal maniacs. Be careful out there. Get the show on the road. if she saw me. This is such a bad idea. Dan, we sprung a leak. Move, move, move! Hit your burners, pilot! I'll be there soon. Stay on target. Head over to Bright Future.
for a car I sold eight years ago? Goodbye. It's a long way down. in those barrels. Kissing goodbye. Thanks. You're a big help.
Okay, truck, don't blow up on me. Better get a move on. Right, future. We just lost a barrel. What did I tell you? Pedal to the metal. I'm on my way. to kill it than be killed. Ain't that the truth? I totally thought you'd have blown yourself up by now, or turned into some kind of jelly monster. Anyway, keep those trucks rolling in. Lots more out there. Line. Santo, Ileso. Police have dismissed allegations that the Ketchum family is live streaming a secret murder circus from their abandoned factory compound on New Birmingham Island. Lawyer. Out of the vehicle, now! Let's head over to Bright Future. Juana Villalobos, Star Registered News Network. in those barrels.
toxic waste, Dan. Well, you're fucked. Unless you get that truck here too sweet. We're coming in hot, so be ready. That's good right there, boss. Flash, Santo Ileso. Public health officials are warning people to stay away from trucks filled with toxic waste. They may contain chemicals which can turn ordinary people into violent homicidal killers, a condition doctors are calling toxic rage. This has been the Star Register News Network. Juana Villalobos reporting. Again, I gotta find that truck. <laughs> gotta haul this load to the dump. Dan, you gotta leave. Yeah, you better get that truck down here pronto. I'm on my way. Haul this load to the dump.
We're leaking toxic waste, Dan. Move, move, move! Hit your burners, pilot! Thanks for the advice. Looking good, boss. That's far enough. Ah! Share now. I have a bad feeling about this. I like your style. What the fuck is in those barrels? Thanks for warming the seat for me. Gotta haul this load to the dump. Thanks for the advice. You're doing great, boss. New high score, here I come.
I need this more than you. This is such a bad idea. Dan, barrels are leaking. Oh boy, you better get down here fast or this ain't gonna end well. I'll be there soon. That should just about do it. Why don't you come on up here and we'll talk business? Well, that should just about do it. You found the last truck and we're all full up. So now we go out and find more customers? Nope. We blackmail the ones we already have. Those big greedy corporations have deep pockets. Blackmail? What for? For illegal waste disposal. We have all the evidence we need right here. Oh yeah. And maybe next time they'll drive their own damn trucks to the dump.
somebody gonna report this? Now I remember why I stopped doing this. That's offensive. Can we talk about this tomorrow instead? This don't concern you. I'm having a blast. This don't concern you. Lies on to us. The real tactics include running. <laughs> ah! God, this will be a brawl.
Oh yeah! Hell yeah! Our crew just finished a job. You wanna go with me to get our cut? Sure. Meet you at the church. One of our crews just pulled off an armored truck heist. They're splitting up the cash. Stealing insured money. My favorite victimless crime. Let's go get our piece. Remember when we had to pull our own heist to pay rent? Yeah, feels like it was last week. Seems like cheating. Our crew does all the work and we sit back and collect money. Who trained the crew? We did. And who has the crews back if they screw up? We do. Exactly. We earned the right to sit back and collect money. Yeah, you're right. I guess we've hit the big time. There they are. Stole an armored truck and busted it open? Good job. Thanks. Your training video on the weak points of different models really helped. Well, preparation is key. Eli taught me that. Wiped the prints yet? Twice. So he just sprayed it with air freshener, just in case they bring in dogs. I like the thoroughness. Got the money divided and bagged up. Here's your share. Cops found us. 
They had no chance. Get behind cover! Police ain't nothing! the hell? Did they send the entire precinct? This is a lot of heat for one armored car. <laughs> Thought they could kill me? We need to get the crew out of here! We'll draw the cops after us. The rest of you scatter. Nina, grab that armored truck. Nice! That should keep their attention on us! coming to us live outside the Santo Ineso police station. I'll make this quick. The Santo Ineso PD has identified a new menace plaguing the streets of our city, known as... Holy shit, that's us! The Purple Shirt Mafia. What? That's not our name! As of today, they are public enemy number one, which is why I'm creating a special task force to bring these criminals to heel. A task force? Holy shit! We really have hit the big time. Uh, you do realize this is gonna be a huge problem, right? They can't even get our name right. How much trouble can they be? We'll see. I don't believe all that Hollow Earth bullshit. Stop living in a fantasy! I can do this all day! What's up? I'm tired of her bullshit! Check out this prime real estate. We've got a Max, Sunstroke Video, the grocery store, and in the middle of it all, our very own laundromat. Sure, we wash clothes here, but we also offer full-service crime scene cleanup. You know, for people who don't want to go to jail. 
<laughs> Winston here's the best. When I first moved into our old place, he cleaned all the bloodstains out of that carpet. He is a master. Hey, Winston. You got everything you need? Sure do, boss. We got disinfectants, solvents, three kinds of acid, anything you might need to make a crime look like it never happened. Awesome. And the crew's ready? They're a little green around the horns, but they know what to do. Well, if things get complicated, I'm just a phone call away. Thanks, boss. Appreciate it. It's Nacho Night at Frank's. You might not be the best nachos in town, but you can't beat the price. I, can do I never miss Nacho Night. Yep. Hey, it's Winston. I have a crew that needs your help. I'm in line for nachos right now. How soon are you thinking? 20 minutes ago? Shit, alright. Send me the address and have him call me. I really wanted those nachos. Deep breaths, MJ. What's going on? So we get to the scene, and I'm talking to the client. Jerry's keeping watch, and I call Jerry over to check out the car, and all of a sudden, his gun goes off. I shot Melvin in the face, boss. Shut up, Jerry. Okay, calm down. Clean up the bodies. We'll figure out something when I get there. All right, let's take it from the top. Melvin's wife was cheating on him with some street thug. He kills the guy and hires us to dump the body in Old Town so the whole thing looks like a mugging gone bad. Then this happens. Someone must have heard the shot. Cops are everywhere. The bodies are in the trunk, right? Give me the keys. I'll finish the job. Thanks, boss. You're saving us. Big time. Don't thank me yet. The money we lost here is coming out of your share. One up pretty good. Oof, so I heard. Got everything you need? Yeah, but Jerry and MJ need to cover our losses. That's fair. I'll take care of it. I just wanted some damn nachos. This bottle do. Now let's give the car a good beating. Jerry shot him in the face. I should do it. 
Now how about those nachos? There's a book signing at the art gallery. Wonder what that's about? Post-dialectic futilitarianism and metacapitalist visual representation? Nina loves shit like this. I'll get her a signed copy. I don't understand any of this, but Nina will dig it. Hello. Hey, boss, I'm sorry, but we got a situation. I'm a little busy at the moment. Jerry and his crew have a big mess on their hands. I'd help them myself, but I'm risk deep in a snitch's brains right now. You're killing me here. Where are they? I'll send you the address. Jerry will call you on the way. Hope they're still signing books when I'm done. Tell me what you got, Jerry. Shit's looking bad. We don't have the crew for a job like this. What's the problem? I've never seen so many cops. If we go out there, we'll be spotted for sure. Keep working. I'll be there soon. What's going on here? This guy went for a joyride with some prostitutes. Things got out of hand, and now he's dead. And this guy is? The district fucking attorney of Santo Eleso. Well, that explains the cops. So what are we gonna do? The DA was going after the idols. Let's stick it on them. Okay, but where do we dump the body? I know a place. Throw me the keys. You're a lifesaver, boss. How's that favor looking? Like a pain in the ass. You owe me for this. Gotta move fast. He's closing soon.
nothing in the trunk, officer, except the district attorney. to make it look like an idol's hit. Shoot up the car or something. Now to shoot up the car. Idol style. Now to shoot up the car. Idol style. Good enough. Let's get that book for Nina. Truck's supposed to be here. There we go. Season tickets just went on sale. The Saints could always use more bonding time. Fuck it. I'll splurge. I expected this line to be longer. Hello. Are you free right now? I'm in line for season tickets. What's going on? I've got a crew freaking out, and I'm swamped with three other clients who need their shit handled now. Send me the address. What's the job? Should be a simple drop. The client off some big shot, now we gotta ditch the body. I'll have the crew give you a call. Hope they don't sell out. What's going on? It's a madhouse, boss. I don't know what to do. Calm down and walk me through it. Cops are everywhere, and Jerry's in the corner throwing up. We're in over our heads. Hang tight. I'll be there in a minute. God damn it.
You're here. I'm in a rush, so fill me in. Nikki Sharp killed a guy and hired us to dump the body. We gotta take this car and park it in front of the train. Who's in the trunk? That's the problem. It's Bobby Firth. Who? His family owns the Pacific National Railroad. They've got so much pull. Every cop in Santo Alesso is out there looking for him. All right. Throw me the keys. But what about the cops? I'll worry about the cops. You finish cleaning up. Yep, just gotta park this car in front of a train. Well, if you hurry, you could catch the 615 down to Smelterville. On my way. I never even heard of this Bobby Firth guy. <laughs> Hope that train's running late. I'm cutting it close. All aboard. Ticket office better be open when we're done with this bullshit. season ticket. Market? I should get some produce for Kev. Okay, so tomatoes, avocados, onions. Hello? Winston here. Quick question. Do you know anyone who can drive a monster truck? Yeah. Me. Great. Here's the address. I'll have the crew fill you in. Looks like I'll have to come back here another time. Make it quick. I'm driving. 
Long story short, this monster truck driver, he owed a lot of money to the wrong kind of people. Now he's dead, and we gotta deal with the body. Thing is, the cops are out there looking for him. Hang tight. I'm almost there. Where's the truck? On the east side, over in Old Town. All the bodies in the trunk of this car here. At least, what's left of them. The client wants us to crush the car with the body inside. You know, to send a message. With his own monster truck? Brutal. He won't feel nothing. But we can't handle that kind of ride. Give me the keys. Thanks, boss. Here's where you can find the truck. Winston? Think you can manage this one? Are you kidding me? I put the monster in monster truck. Now why would you kill a guy who owed you money? Sharks in this town don't fuck around. I wonder if they still have monster truck rallies at the Smelter Dome. my monster truck. Better hurry it up. Crushed it. Now where was that farmer's market again? We're way up high.
do this every time I try to talk to you. Here for the party. Can you buzz me in? It's great weather for a rooftop party. Hope they didn't expect me to bring anything. Winston! Hey boss, sorry to bother you, but we got a problem. What's going on? MJ's freaking out. The cops are all over Lakeshore. I'm across town cleaning up a triple homicide at the OK Motel. Don't worry. I'm on my way. Thanks. I'll have MJ call you. Back to work. your way. What happened? The Morris twins they ro robbed the yacht club but tripped the alarm and, and, and the cops were right fucking there in the marina and, and, and... MJ, I need you to take a breath and calm down so we can get through this. Okay. They managed to lose the cops, but Jesse got clipped. Where's the getaway car? We moved it to a warehouse in Lakeshore, but the cops are looking for it. We'll be fine. Just focus on cleaning up the evidence. And the car? I'll take care of it. Boss, thank God you're here. Less talk, more cleaning. This must be the car? Yeah, we did the best we could. Throw me the keys and finish up here. Don't let the cops see you. Finishing up here. Should I head over? You might want to check on MJ. I've got the car. I heard on the scanner they know the make and model. The regular dumping grounds might not keep it hidden for long. Yeah, you're probably right. It's a nice car. Too bad we can't just wash the crime off it. Maybe we can. How about I dump it in the lake? Good idea. That works. Jesse better make it. Better hurry it up. How'd this get so out of hand? got some partying to do.
Dateline, Santo Ileso. The local food truck scene has a new reigning champion, Chalupa Cabra, a traditional taqueria that offers popular Mexican favorites on the go. Restaurant manager Chuy Hernandez announced that Chalupa Cabra would operate its trucks citywide to replace Twisty Creamy, Six Shooter Samurai. Go back to driving school! Nice pick. I'm commandeering your vehicle. Move out the dang way! Those This must be the place for Speed Daters Anonymous. Mingling with singles should be a nice change of pace. Ah, oh, man, this sucks. I gotta get out of here. Yo, Winston. You need to ditch a party I'm at? Got anything I can help with? You bet. Something just came up in Old Town. Send me the address, and have the crew give me a call. Thank God for that. What are we looking at? Building construction is beefing with Nikki Sharp over some job down in the Badlands. So Nikki sends an enforcer to scare him. But these construction guys, they don't back down. They shot the enforcer and called us to clean it up. All right, I'll be there in a sec. Where's the enforcer? In the trunk. The client wants to send a message with a front loader. A front loader? We need to flip the car into a quarry down in the Badlands. It's got to be flipped or it's no good. That's weirdly specific. Give me the keys. Be careful. Police are on the lookout. I bet someone tipped them off. Hey, Winston. Thanks again for helping me out. Anytime. On your way to the quarry? Yep. Just trying to remember how to work the scoop on a front loader. Sorry. I can't help you with that. Good luck. Shit. Gotta drive all the way down to the Badlands? Better hurry it up. Why do I have to flip the car? What kind of message is that?
At least this is better than speed dating. Now to get the front loader. Hope they left a manual in the cab. I'm cutting it close. You know, maybe speed dating isn't so bad after all. Boss, if you got a sec, swing by the laundromat. It's my lucky day. Having the time of my life. I don't think I know how to answer this. Fuck these saints. This is like amazing. Cha ching.
our crew's a top-notch crime scene cleaning machine, thanks to you. They'll be ready to handle any situation after this. Cute. Keeping it strange. This pisses me off.
there. What up, what up, what up? It's your girl at... What the hell are the I'm saints doing here? <laughs> Hey, good to see you. Bud! No, that's not an amazing idea. Pay attention next time and you'll learn something. Disrupt the market. We gotta be proactive. With this startup incubator, we'll turn ideas into IPOs. This house has everything our inventors need to build the future. And guess who I got to run this ship? Chloe fucking Morris. <laughs> Man, if you haven't seen her talk, you haven't lived. Her last venture went down hard, so she's hungry for a win. Don't worry about your hey, Chloe. How we doing here? Good. Our first product just entered alpha. When can I see it? 
Today, if you want to help with testing. Do I need a helmet? Nah, you're good. Just head on over to the field lab. I'll send you the location. I need this. Love the view. This is test 4.37 alpha of product RTP62-8S. So what do I do? Just hop on the board. Now what? Can you move it around? Nope, nothing. Hold on. 
Now try. Uh, it's moving, but not the way I wanted to. Wait a minute. Some asshole inverted the controls again. There. Okay, that's better. Now try jumping. Like that? Perfect. Now head over to Lakeshore. It works on water? Sure, if it has power. Can it do tricks and flips and stuff? Not yet. The repulsors overload with too much spin. That sounds like a good thing. Well, spin creates a feedback loop. Instead of pushing up off the ground, it slams the board down. Now I'm curious. Let me try doing some tricks. Okay, but I warned you. Stabilizers are off. Oh, that's a lot of force. You could crush a car with this. A car? Yeah. Check this out. I'm gonna blow up some cars. That's not in the test plan, but... Alright. Sweet. This thing's a total car crusher. We hadn't considered that use case, but... That's why we run tests. Where did we find this thing, anyway? Marshall. A former employee stole the prototype and came to work for us. Give me an idea. I'm going to the boot. You mean the Marshall building? That's the one. What's the point of stealing from Marshall if they don't know we took it? That's not usually how stealing works. I really feel like I'm in the future. You'd be surprised how old this tech is. Oh yeah? Marshall's toy division released it in 1989. Marshall has a toy division? Had. Some kids got injured, so they took it off the market. Nearly wiped out the whole company. They stopped making toys after that. Poor Atticus. All he ever wanted was to make toys. How does it feel? Wobbly, but I'm getting the hang of it. Watch out for traffic. I'm watching. What do we call this thing? It's a single operator repulsor transit platform. That's terrible. We don't have a brand team yet. Naming shit is hard. Whoa, check out those executive rides. I'm gonna crush them up. Just keep an eye out for security. They're not gonna like this. Some of these cars are seven figures. I think that one belonged to the CFO. We're about to heat up. Just one more. Okay, I've had my fun. Time to get the fuck out. I think Marshall wants their board back. Well, it's our board now. Don't worry, they won't catch me. I lost him. Well, that's a relief. Good test. I'm totally keeping this board, you know. Hey, you're the boss. We've got another product for you to test. I'll send you the location. Right now? Whatever.
only scrubs play charge characters. This is test 71.8 alpha of product QA99-5, mode S. So what are we testing? Something that lets you shoot through walls. Like a rail gun? More like a rail window. We call it the quantum aperture. We really need that brand team. We'll present a series of live targets. You'll deploy the aperture and shoot them. We'll start with this transparent barrier. Calibrating for stage two. Uh, are these guys gonna be okay? Oh yeah, they're fine. The aperture's in safety mode. I don't know. They're very convincing. Well, most of our testers are theater majors. Oh. Stage two is a metallic barrier. Whenever you're ready. I'm good. Got them all. Good. Recalibrating. Did we steal this from Marshall too? We sure did. They scuttled the project last month. So the lead engineer brought the talk to us. We're making it happen. All right. Stage three is the smoke test. Do that. Now, how would this thing do in a real fight? I don't know. We haven't run a field test yet. No time like the present. Well. Marshall is running a combat exercise in the depot across the street. Perfect. So how do you want to do this? Turn off safety mode. Let's show him our new gun. Safety's off. Happy hunting. Lock and load! Aperture. Huge success. Good. I 
make me note here. Marshall might complicate future testing. Don't worry, I can handle Marshall. Keep that model with you, just in case. We set up another field lab down in Smelterville. I think you'll want to see this. Now! Check this out.
Got it. Wanna watch? This is test 42.1 alpha of product HE17-5DI. What is this? Some kind of football? It's a high explosive device with adhesive target interface and kinetically triggered rocket propulsion system on ignition delay. So not a football then. First, we'll test the adhesive target interface. Touch each tester with the device. We'll see if it sticks. Definitely not a football. We call it the Thrust Buster. They're gonna be okay? Our QA testers are professionals. There's nothing they can't handle. That's badass. Please continue. Okay, got them all. What's next? Next, we'll test the kinetically triggered rocket propulsion system. This time, you'll throw the device at each tester. Pretty good arm. Balancing the projector so it can be deployed at range is one of the harder problems we've had to solve. But I think we're close. I really should have been a quarterback. So what would this do to something bigger? Like a car? That would be stage three. Got word that Marshall's on their way. Is there any tech we didn't steal from Marshall? Sure, but it's all in pre-pro. Then how about another field test? Let's do it. Telemetry is live. Ah! Ooh. Oh! 
bugs to fix, as expected. Fail early, fail often, right? Another canceled project? Yeah. Marshall couldn't get it to fly straight. That's not a bug. It's a feature. Sometimes, innovation's about seeing what's right in front of you. getting tired stay in the game you're first in goal Mind if I keep this? Hey, you earned it. Thanks again. That's our last test for now. Stop by the incubator when you get a chance. Looks like your testing put us ahead of schedule, and Marshall might have shut us down if it weren't for you. Let me know if they give you any more trouble. Definitely my style.
Next time, buy your own enchiladas. I think the saints are going to make it. This sucks. I'll find you soon. No oh. surprise there. Right there.
these assholes! Too easy. Good eye.
So I said, give him my forty-two dollars back. And put it this is awesome. Great from the th Partner, you gotta help me. The cops are on my ass. JR? Calm down. Where are you? I'm on the move. God, I think it's that purple shirt mafia task force. Those fucking clowns? Shit. I'll get Kevin. We'll figure something out. Kev, we gotta go. That police task force is going after JR. They linked him to us? I thought they were a bunch of morons. So did I. They couldn't even get our name right. <laughs> JR, I got Kev. Where are you at? Just outside the Lancelot Casino. We're on our way. Hurry! Lancelot Casino? Is that the place with the mead and meat and meat? Yeah, I think so. I hear their turkey legs are amazing. We should check it out when things calm down. This doesn't Come all out. There's JR. Cops have him surrounded. You're messing with the big dog now. Not what I wanted. Thanks. I thought I was going to jail for sure. What happened? How did they connect you to us? All I know is they came to the shop with a warrant for me and my records, signed by the chief of police herself. I dipped out the back and called you. Fuck, so they have your records? That could sink us. Don't worry, I don't keep my records at the shop. Shit, more cops! <laughs> this stranger is more innocent! Power. Surrender yourself! Y'all can talk to my lawyer. Better use my gun. 
You can't run from us! Yep, I did that. That was me. JR! Just deny, deny, deny! Purple <laughs> Dirt Mafia is going down! JR, where do you keep your records? We can't let the task force find them. A place called Happy Cat Self Storage, over in the flats. All right, I'll go destroy everything linking you to the Saints. Kev, you keep JR safe. Got it. Task force is already here. I just hope I can burn all JR's files before the cops find him. Pitch the head of purple shirt. Ah! Never leave this storage facility alive. Better find it all before the cops one carton down. Task Force, getting up in our business. What was their name again? Fucking cops, fucking everywhere. Gotta hurry. Halfway there. I want that purple shirt mafia down. Ah! Worst filing system ever. Thank God for no digital backups. Almost done. Race these assholes to the evidence. There. That was everything. JR's records are nothing but ash. Guys, I took care of the evidence. Whew. You really saved my hiding. No prob. Oh shit. Cops are here in force. Fucking ah! helicopter! There. Oh, fuck that file system. Oh. Oh. Jeez. Chief of police seems to have a real burr up her butt about us. What do we do? We gonna need to lie low? Not by a long shot. We keep building our empire. When we're ready, we'll deal with her, and her task force.
Badass! Now, legit repo companies won't touch a job that's too risky or shady or weird. But we're not afraid to get our hands dirty. We don't need contracts or documentation. If a customer wants it back, we get it back. Cash up front, no questions asked. My friend Amanda just lost her bounty hunter license, and she's really good at finding things that don't want to be found. She's also a total badass, so... Be nice. Hey, Amanda. Where's your crew? They're all out on repo jobs. Got so many orders coming in, we can't keep up. Then why don't you send some my way? I'll take care of them. Sure. If you don't mind getting your hands dirty, you can use that tow truck over there. Sweet. Where should I start? I'll send you the addresses. Just, you know, give me a call whenever you grab the goods. I want to talk about this time. I picked up what looks like a bank vault. 
On my way back. Now, I've no idea what's in there, okay? So try not to shake it too much. There. Got that repo for ya. Right there's fine.
Yo, Amanda. I'm heading back with that tricked-out engine. I hope Los Panteros didn't give you too much trouble. Nice one. There you go. Perfect. Amanda, what's the deal with this fire engine? Chief's in hot water over some bad loans. He put up city property for collateral. Must have been pretty desperate. Loan sharks don't care. They take what's owed, and then some. Let's get this asshole!
Got that repo for you. Much obliged. That truck's supposed to be here. Amanda, I snagged that box of fireworks. Careful heading back. You don't want them going off while you're on the road.
my abuela's gonna kill me. This job's done. I'll check it off the list.
can't talk to you when you get hysterical like this. Hey, Amanda. I'm at the shipyard. This is a nice boat. Damn well better be. It's the fastest boat in Lake Sebastian. Someone miss a payment? Nah. They lost a bet. Loser didn't want to pay up. Well, they're paying now. Dropping it off now. Right there's fine.
Was I supposed to grab this tank? Marshall shortchanged our client on an order. This should even things up. Too easy. Dropping it off now. Perfect.
y'all doing? Hey, Amanda. I'm on my way with those weapons I jacked from the items. Our clients will be happy to get their stuff back.
dropping it off now. Right on. Well, we're all caught up. Thanks to you. How about you swing by? Thanks for lighting the load, boss. Couldn't have done it without you. This speaks to me. Saints just got lucky. Get the fuck out of there! What is going on? They tear you apart! Fun time. Sometimes you just gotta take that risk. Whoa! 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 
Jeez, it's just a milkshake, all right? I'd like 20 burgers with nothing but lettuce in them, please. Hey, good to see you.
Hey, I heard you got a job for me. My crew just got pinched by the cops in Lakeshore. I need someone to take them both out before they cut deals and flip on me. No honor among thieves, eh? Who told you we were thieves? Who snitched? It's just a figure of speech. We'll see. Ron and Millie are already on their way to the station. Don't let them into the building, you got me? Read you loud and clear. See the cop car with one of the targets. Take him out. Mom's dead. That's what snitches get. That sure pissed the cops off. You killed someone in custody. What do you expect? Now get to the police station fast. SWAT team is rushing Millie there for protection. You need to hurry. If Millie squeals, I'm going to jail for a long time. If I go to jail, you are not getting paid. Millie's outside the station. She's with the cops. Finish it! <laughs> Took care of her. No one's snitching on you. Good. Better not tell nobody. Next on the wanted action, you know what I mean.
life isn't for me. Saints ain't nothing to worry about. Hello. I saw your wanted post. Having trouble with Los Panteros? Boy, am I. Those assholes keep scaring away my customers. I need an example made out of them. I'll take care of them for you. That'd be mighty helpful. Left you a little present to help you out. A monster truck? I want you to smash those some bitches with it. You can find them tearing around the desert nearby. like they used to. Rest all the cars. Great. Now all she gotta do is take out Louisa. She's the leader of this crew. She's always out driving around God knows where, so you'll need to lure her out. Smashing up her shit should do the trick. She manages the Pantero's gym over in Smelterville. Those Pantero's cars are all so nice and shiny. Didn't even feel that one. Speed bump! I took care of your Pantero's problem. Thanks a million. Now I can get my business back on track.
Stay the hell out of Pantero's business. I always had it. You're on a one way shoot to hell! Good eye. Yeah, sure, sure. Good luck with that. Surprise, surprise. Oh! I need a pick of this. What are the safe want? Wow. A yoga teacher gave me an F. Surprise, surprise. I do always get the last word. Get the fuck out of there! Yeah, I saw your post. Need a spy taken out? Shh, they could be listening. Okay. So, during my ancient astronaut podcast last week, I picked up a coded message by a Russian or a 
North Korean or, or, or Canadian spy. Right. I know it sounds crazy. Yes, yes it does. Our national security is on the line here. I tracked the signal to the spy's hideout. Okay, I'll look into it. Have a look around. Hmm. Locked. Doesn't look like anyone's home. You sure this is the place? Absolutely. Well, I don't see anything out of the ordinary. Any outbuildings? A, a trailer or something? I'll check. That RV looks sketchy. Ah! Jesus! It just blew up! Booby traps! You see, I was right! Okay, so maybe you're on to something here. Of course I am! Everything I believe is true! Someone's camped up on that hill! Is it the spy? Seeing as they're shooting at me, yes. Okay, take them out! Done. <laughs> All those trolls who made fun of me can eat it! It's a long way down. Got it.
that's a keeper. Love the view. Mind if I keep this? that. Yo, I saw your post. What do you need? A no-good lowlife's been stealing cars around these parts. I demand vigilante justice. How can I exact that for you? I set aside a bait car for you. It is just her time. I'll go get it. Okay, I found the car. What's next? Next, we blow them sky high. I left a bomb for you to attach to the car. Now this is getting interesting. The bomb is on the car. Now to set the trap for this some bitch. Here's where you can park the car. Heading there now. Hey, 
Ну, Trap set. I'll go wait across the street. She looks suspicious. The target's in the car. Shit. The remote's not working. Got her. Hell yeah! No more car rustlers in my neighborhood, no sir. That'll do. Finders keepers. I can put this to good use. Finders keepers. Picked up your job on Wanted. 
What's up? We got some real lowlifes out here brewing meth in our RV park. They brew meth? Like beer? How the hell should I know? Because I live in a trailer park, I'm a meth expert now? Just grab the truck I left for you and haul that trailer out of here. I'm on it. Thank you kindly. Interesting. Found the meth lab. Now drag that sucker out of here and blow it to kingdom come. Can't I just blow it up here? Hell no. You never seen a meth explosion? You take out the whole RV park. Bring it out behind ringers. The owner's selling this poison out the back of his store. Let him deal with this mess. Got it. Stop the meth dealers. Fun times. Good.
too easy. Blow this thing sky high. Hey, I that meth lab for you. Thank heaven. job then I'm not truly an artist. That's strange. Good eye. How you doing, boss? I don't know Deborah, but if I meet her, I'll, I'll tell her you call. Keep it on till the break of dawn. Good thing purple is my color. Three shakes are not enough. I 
was thinking, if we're gonna run a criminal empire, why not get into arms trafficking? I mean, we need all those weapons anyway, so let's buy in bulk and move the product ourselves. If Los Panteros can do it, why can't we? So, I got Sergeant Vicario to come work for us. She was in the guard and knows all the suppliers and buyers. She'll hook us up. How's our inventory? We're armed to the teeth, but supply's easy. Demand's where we gotta bring our A-game. It's a buyer's market, huh? Everyone and their grandma's running guns these days. We need a killer pitch. Leave that to me. I'll blow stuff up, show off our merchandise. We can stream it live to our customers. <laughs> now you're talking. Nina tells me no one can blow up shit better than you. I'll call you when I'm ready. Thank you very much! Okay, we're through here. Big one, Vicario speaking. Hey Sarge, ready to make a sale? Sure, I've got some buyers asking about our RPGs. Let's show them what we got. Those buyers. They seem pretty jaded. Better take it up a notch. Panteros. Fun times. Chance. 
Nice one. No one's gonna forget this car show anytime soon. Now! I know! My gym membership. Where are these saints coming from? Hey, it's me. You're just in time. I've got a buyer in Buenos Aires. She's in the market for a strike fighter with VTOL capability. Do we even have VTOLs? Uh, just some Marshall 921s that fell off a truck. That's a big truck. So how'd you get the VTOLs? You just gotta know the right people and can fill out the right paperwork. Looks like Marshall wants their stuff back. Buyer. I don't know. She's hard to read. Just keep blowing stuff up. That's pretty much how I solve all my problems. what I can. No promises. And that's how you seal the deal.
This work is the foundation of our society. Finders keepers. Cha-ching! Check this out. Newsflash, Santo y to the Pacific National Railroad Portion. Looks good. Car, which had collided with a speeding train near Smelterville. This has been Juana Villalobos, reporting for the Star Register News Network. Where's that truck? Big one? Hey, I'm over at the Aztec. What's our pitch? We've got a four-star buyer who needs more armor. You've driven a tank before, right? Sure. My first car was a tank. I don't know how to do it any other way. out in force good hold your own against Marshall we'll sell a lot more tanks
still got it. between you and me. We did. Monsoon! Vicario here. I'm at Meeker Square. How about we show off some merchandise? Perfect. I got a buyer all lined up. Looks like the idols have something going on here. Not anymore.
How we doing? Looking good. Keep it up. Flash, Santo Ileso. Police Chief Lee Michaels has announced the formation of a special task force to investigate the so-called Purple Shirt Mafia and bring its ringleaders to justice. The organization is blamed for recent increases in car thefts, smuggling, armored truck heists, and reckless driving. Citizens with information about the Purple Shirt Mafia are urged to contact... Arms Depot. Hey, I'm at the fairgrounds. Found a good spot for a demo. And let's sell some rocket launchers. really made a mess of this place. This is one way to clean it up. Hey, looks like we've got some orders coming in. And I'm just getting warmed up.
it, pal! Leave me alone! Get out. I am pissed off. Hate purple. The customer is seldom right. Things are never that simple. Love the view. Big one. Vicario speaking. I'm in Lakeshore. Got any leads? Just heard from a dealer in Thailand. Her client needs a fleet of gunships. Then let's show her the floor model. Don't worry, she ain't seen nothing yet. Now. And let's put on a show.
for the big finale. Only if I can keep this bird in the air. Thanks to you, we're putting up some big numbers. Stop by the depot when you get a chance. Enough of your stupid. The word is out. When you need the best high explosive ordnance money can buy, the big one's a one stop shop. Except no substitute. I like your style. I'm not even...
Collective will save us. No surprise there. Boss. My whole wardrobe is broken now. So, how you been?
mistakes are not enough. Hey, I've been thinking. Now that the Saints are a real organization, I feel like I should have a better understanding of, you know, all the basic skills involved in day-to-day -day operations. Uh, which means? I was hoping you could teach me to shoot. Oh, yeah, sure. Meet me at the old quarry. I set us up a kick-ass practice range. We're way up high. Hey, wow. Eli, you set this range up yourself? Yep. I didn't have any clay pigeons, so I had to make do with what I could find. Nice. What weapons are you gonna use? Oh, I'm more of a book learner. I've done some research already. I just wanted to watch you, ask questions, and take notes. That's not really how you learn to shoot. Hey, everybody learns differently. Now, the first thing I saw in my research was that stance is very important. Sure. You gotta have a stance. So what's a good stance? I mean, this? I can't describe it, I, I just gotta do it. Watch. Damn! Yeah, I get it. Next, my research said, keep your eyes open when you shoot? Sure. I like to pretend there's a little white dot or crosshairs on whatever I'm shooting at, and then just aim for it. Like this.
Damn! Yeah, I get it. What about breath control? I read a lot about exhaling when you pull the trigger. Honest to God, Eli, in a big firefight, I pay no attention to how I'm breathing. I just... well, look. And my research said to squeeze the trigger instead of pulling it? What the fuck's the difference? There's just a feel to it. Look. Very impressive. Let's see what you were doing there. Hey, what's up with those trucks? Looks like Marshall. Uh... We're probably near one of their Black Ops sites. Trespassers on Marshall Land will be shot! Grab a gun! You won't get away with our Hey! Hey! I got one! Good job, man! See what I mean about the dot thing? Hey, I'm pretty good yeah, you're fair game now! This is our piece of abandoned dirt! It is against you're doing great, Eli! Land. Get down! Oh, no. More trucks coming. Let's take them. Uh, this may be a bit much for a beginner. Get in the car. You drive. I'll do the covering fire from the uh, roof there. Wait, that's not. Oh. Yeah, you better run. Get back here. Should have got the roof right. Don't let them escape! Keep your fair game now! Hey, like this! You won't get away with our training secrets! Oh my god, there's so many of them! Okay. Ammo's out! Okay, okay! Whoa, 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 whoa! I'm gonna puke! What am I doing? Fuck! Okay, that was maybe a bit more hands-on learning than I was hoping for. Hey, no. You did great out there. I guess next time I'm in a tight spot like that idols party, I can slow him down. But I think I'll leave the car roof shit to you from now on. Lock and load. Jeez, just a milkshake, all right? When you got a minute, I could use your help with a personal problem. Sure. Everything okay? It's better if I tell you in person. So meet me at the hobby store. I'm just finishing up a supply run.
This is a ride share now. What are you wearing? Should I be concerned? Well, the dust moot event is upon us, and I need to join a house if I want to see the best action. Were those real words? What's a dust moot? Get in the car and I'll tell you on the way. Okay. The dust moot's the citywide LARP I do every year. I applied to join House Dust Storm, but they said I don't have enough XP. Slow it down there, bud. What the fuck's a LARP? Live action roleplay. Oh, like wizards and shit. Well, but the dust moves more of a, um, post apocalyptic meets night for the round table kind of thing. And you want to join House Dust Storm, which is a building? Think of it like a team. Ah, but they won't let you join, so you want me to bust some heads. No, I just need someone to grind with. Don't we all? Not like that. Like grinding for XP, so. We help? Fine. Okay! First things first. Let's get you suited up. What's wrong with my current look? Thou lookest like a knave in thy garments. And real weapons are forbidden on pain of banishment. Why are you talking like that? I'm in character. But never fear. I know the best place to procure weapons. all this amazing material they just threw out. All I see are cardboard and fabric remnants. Exactly. Now, to don thy armor. Let's don away. Great. I'll just put this here, that there, and done. Your first LARP outfit. Had to use the last of my duct tape, but it was worth it. At least it's comfortable. Here, this is the LARP weapon I used when I started out. I like to pass it on to you. Oh, thank thee. Try it out. Shoot someone. Uh, okay. Still got it. See, the whole city plays the dust move. They die a worthy death. They get on with their day. Weird, but cool. Now you're ready to play. Let's go join House Dust Storm. So why have I never heard of this LARP stuff before now? I have no idea. You never heard Gwen Terrio talk about it? Wait, Gwen plays this? My old CO Gwen? Yeah, she runs House Phoenix. Wait, she never mentioned it? LARP is like the only thing that gives her life meaning. I got money on her winning the whole event. So it would really get to her if we won. We, what, win it? Yeah, that would get to her. I hope it's not too late to change my bet. Well, then I'm a hundred percent in. Great. Now, promise me you'll honor the rules of the dust mode. Yeah, of course. No claiming that the other players missed you when their attacks actually hit. No problem. No actual killing of players. <sighs> Fine. Fine? Yes, deal, okay? For a game, you're really taking the fun out of it. We need to head off road here. Now thou must face the warriors of House Tapeworm. House what now? Tapeworm. What happened to Dust Storm? We're gonna set a Tapeworm beacon on fire. Then Dust Storm will have to let us join. Oh, this game requires strategy. Why don't I just shoot whoever isn't you? Shoot? LARP, shoot. There they are. Let's park and walketh on foot. Do mine eyes deceive me? What brings Elijah the Wise to the land of Tapeworm? Seek ye to join with the Great Worm? Nay, I am here on behalf of House Duststorm. Lies! We know thou art houseless. Duststorm shall welcome us with open arms once we torch thy beacon. Yeah, on guard! Uh, shitlords? It's us against you! Uh. All great things come to an end! No. 
Now, we light the beacon on fire and await Tapeworm's arm response. Hell yeah! Now we just need to inform Fort Dustor. We could do that, or we could start our own house. Be thine own lord. Sounds nice, but we need to build a fort first. So we build a fort. With what? Tapeworm bought all the duct tape in the city to keep people from doing exactly that. It's a cheap move, but technically legal. So we sack their fort and take their supply. Really? Verily. What would we call our house? We need a good name. Something inspiring. House Sand... something. House Sandy... Kraken. Yes! What? Seriously? We're Sandy Kraken. I have spoken! It is memorable. Holy shit, that's a nice place. Yeah, and impossible to get in unnoticed. We could get them to invite us in. That's genius! Let me do the talking. Halt! Who goes there? Tis I, Elijah the Wise, and... Quick, what, what's your character's name? I don't know. And... Bosonius the Bloody! What business had we here? I wish to... to join with the Great Worm. Huzzah! Thou hast seen reason, and rejected the ways of the dust storm? Aye, they are dicks, and I shall rejoice when they are crushed. Enter, friend. We shall watch their destruction together. All right, now just play it cool until I give the signal. Wait for it. Wait for it. Attack! Your fort just got preggers. Treachery! Upon them. Ah! Ah! I'm no doomed. It. Doomed. Ah! Got to get bent. Ah! 
Fun times. Ancestors, welcome me to your bosom. I shall leave your house in ruin. The Great Worm's treasure hoard must be close. Check on yonder pedestal. Just ammo, no duct tape. Then we must search the ruins of this fort. Stuff. Tis but a microtransaction. Check thine coin purse for funds. Why is there a box of bottle caps? Huzzah! You have found quite the fortune! Mimic. Huh. Don't fucking touch that! That's not loot! Okay, calm down. I won't touch it. Not seeing any duct tape, Eli. The loot must be in the belly of the great tapeworm itself. You must slay the beast to retrieve the treasure. That's the rules. Oh. <clears throat> I shall enter through its gullet. And I shall wait here, for I am claustrophobic. You must burst the polyps inside. Polyps? I can't tell if that's disgusting or awesome. I think they did it for Colon Cancer Awareness Month, and then it just stuck. Oh. 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 
too this easy. Battle starve you. Ah! Phew! I see the treasure. This is a shit ton of duct tape. Now, fell beast, void me from thy fundament. Got the duct tape? I guess we're gonna create our own house. Aye. Together we shall burn Gwen and House Phoenix into ash. And have a fun bonding experience, right? Yes. That too. I hate it when things are too quiet. What's up, boss? Fortress arises, a stronghold forged from the mightiest duct. All shall fall under the shadow of our new house, Sandy Kraken. School thyself in the mysteries of the prophecy. Here our destiny is foretold in the writing of the ancients. Herodor the Sage is master of law and wise counselor. He paveth our road to victory. Heed his smart word. Hail Bosonius! Law Master, we seek your counsel. The Kraken shall sit upon the dusty throne. So says the prophecy. Then I shall attack the Dust King. Patience, Bosonius. We must first gather strength. I will not cower behind these walls. We shall attack, and our courage will draw the bravest warriors to our cause. A bold plan. But how? We lit the beacon of House Tapeworm and defeated their armies in battle. Could we not do the same to the Phoenix and the Dust Storm? Aye, it is as you say. Then let us find their beacons, and light them, and prove we are worthy of the prophecy.
Master, the beacon of the dust storm is ablaze. Armies of the Dust King shall soon be upon thee. Lead us to victory. Queen Noon and Four? That's some bullshit. Here, what's the common name?
Ausonius, the Dust King wishes to parley. We shall hear him out. Hello? Dust King here. We commend you on your victory, Sandy Kraken. Verily, we thank thee. You have proven yourselves worthy. Now, it is time to bend the knee and swear your fealty to our throne. That fancy chair is gonna be mine, dickhead. You're going down. Ha! Get in line and do your worst. Finders keepers. Look what I found. I'm sorry, I don't think we can afford Christmas this year. It's mine now. This is bullshit. Our saints just reached. <laughs> I found the beacon of House Phoenix. The fire is lit. Legions of the Phoenix are on the march. Hold the line and strike true. Ancestors. 
Welcome me to your bosom. Oh. Oh. House Phoenix wishes to parley. I will speak with her. This is Gwendolyn Firebird of House Phoenix. I congratulate you on your victory. Well said. I propose an alliance. Join our siege of Fort Thunderpump, and we shall crush the Dust King between us. Yeah, sorry, Gwen. No can do. What? Who the fuck is this? Come on. It hasn't been that long, has it? You! God damn it! Fuck with my job all you want, but stay out of my game! This is so worth it. Check this out. Just what I wanted. Sonius, the dust moot calls. I have discovered a way to defeat Gwendolyn Firebird. Huzzah! We shall finally win the crown and rub it in her ye old face. I have gathered our forces at the lookout. I shall be there forthwith.
Love the view. Gather round. I have questioned the Lore Keeper and found the greatest weapon in all the realms. The Bowel Rod. This is why you made me come here? I'm out. Wait, it's a car! Of, of a sort. You love cars! Hmm. Okay. This could be interesting. Huzzah! I have the perfect costume for you. Yes. Perfect. Put this here. I would like the record to show the extent to which I humor my friends. It hath been noted. Lead the way, Elijah the Wise. The call has been answered. House Sandy Kraken stands united against the vile Gwendolyn Firebird. She shall tremble before our collective might. Ah, but first. We must seek out the leader of House Tapeworm. She is the keeper of the battle run, and we must pay her toll. Oh my god. What did I sign up for? Where shall we find this keeper? Well, I called Fort Tapeworm, but she wasn't there. She's at her house. And what price does she demand? A trade. The duct tape we liberated from Fort Tapeworm in exchange for their most sacred weapon. A sacrifice indeed. Aye. But worth it. And what is this bowel rod exactly? Tis a great worm that dwells below the desert wastes. The cry of the bowel rod is so mighty, the walls of Fort Thunder Pump shall crumble at its sound. I thought you said it was a car. For those who don't use their imagination, it is. Look, Nina, I was pretty skeptical at first, too, but give LARP a chance. I promise it's worth it. Fine, let's go get this keeper's blessing. Greetings, Keeper of the Bowel Rod. I am Bosonius of House Sandy Kraken. A new house? Good luck with that. Phoenix and Duststorm have this year locked up. You got my duct tape? It's in the trunk. Great! The Bowel Rod's out back. What's your name, dear? Nina for Leadfoot! 
What? Okay. The Keeper of the Bowel Rod gives Ninafer of House Sandy Kraken her blessing. Go forth and whatever. It's a van. Eli, I'm trying to use my imagination, but... What the hell? The deal was the duct tape for the worm. No one told you. Gwen wanted it out of the game, so she dismantled it. You could reassemble it by, I don't know, stealing the props back from House Phoenix, I guess. Then you just do the ritual and you should be good to go. It's all in the rules book in the blood box. Here are the keys. Housemates, we go to Fort Phoenix to claim what is ours. Hear, hear. Now, in typical Gwen fashion, Fort Phoenix is a sprawling, overbuilt compound with a lot of armed guards. So, I propose we use stealth. Cool. We wait until nightfall, come in downwind of them. Oh, no. It's not complicated. You just drink a potion, cross your arms in front, and then boom, you're invisible. They won't just shoot me? They can't. It's in the rules. What other rules do we need to know? Well, let's see. If you put your arms down, they'll see you. So, that means if you use your weapon or do a melee attack, you lose invisibility. Then how do I stealth attack? You can stealth melee as long as no one else sees you. But if you spot it, then your cover's gone. So what happens if you die? Then you have to re-roll a new character and go back to having zero XP. It sucks. Trust me. We're here. I've only got the one invisibility potion, so you'll have to go in alone. Drink up. What the? Damn it. Arrow to the face! I'm good. <gasps> Shit, it's working. Thrift rip. Gut punch. Easy. Nothing face. Ah! Hot rip. around back and we'll go find the rest of it all right can we go in guns blazing now i'm with ninafer not my name that's such a ninafer thing to say verily let's slip the dogs of war tell the afterlife bostonius sent you, you. cannot take all of us Lost. But the no war one expects continues.
Found the butt. All right, you found foam shotguns too. Nice. I'll start putting this thing back together. You too. What? Thy manner of speaking is strange to my ears. Ugh. I, Nina for a Leadfoot, shall conjure the bowel rod in our time of need. I'm so happy I could cry. Now you two go get the last part. When will have the head somewhere safe? We shall search her keep. They sound the alarm. They know we are here. Greetings, Gwendolyn. Why am I seeing you on my fort security cameras? I thought I told you to leave my game alone. Your game? And here I thought it was everyone's game. Fuck you. You're doing this just to piss me off. I got to protect thy accusation. Good day. I gotta reload! Did you hang up on me? I said good day! No, you listen here. I am on my way over there, and I'm gonna kick your ass for real at... Am I getting pulled over? Hope you're using hands-free. Bye! Son of a... Perfect. Balrog's head must be somewhere here. I always thought I'd die of bubonic plague. on the floor? Pew, pew, pew! Cover! I've got the head. How's it going up there? Got the Balrog's head yet? Forces are closing in. We'll need to wingsuit it down to you. Fly, my friend. Get that to Nina. But what of you? You have no wingsuit. I shall draw the phoenix away to buy you more time. The bow rod is more important than me. Now go! The final piece. Use it. Hurry! Why? Where's Eli? He stayed behind, that I might escape. We have to go back for him. Uh, but first, I shall conjure this fell beast. Holy of holy shit. Now what? Now we need to do the ritual to bring her to life. The instructions say we need a salt circle, so I use the bag of road salt from the trunk. You guys dead yet? The bell rod is nearly restored. Holy shit! You actually did it? Maybe. 
If our two houses work together, we'd actually stand a chance. Really? Join sides? Yeah, why not? <clears throat> when you besiege Fort Thunderpump, look to the horizon. Tapeworm will be there. I'm gonna wreck you! <laughs> Tell the afterlife Bostonius sent you! Run toward cover! They gotta reload. Get this over with. Ecclesia sees Shodu e sisht wichu! Michu re wichu! That's first one of how many? Damn it, we've got incoming. No one expects Bostonian! I'm dead. Take them for a horse! Well, Neil, just give me one second. I smite thee! Oof! Where was I? Uh, oh yeah. I, uh, yup, yup, we choo che! Dongar era! Dongar era! Rhoda sees nutching! Who wrote this shit? Ugh. Here they come again! My ashes in a brothel. Shack. Hold fast. The battle rod is coming. No sandy kraken shall re-roll today. Ahoy, ahoy. You asshole. You know how much that ticket was. You are too late, Firebird. The battle rod lives. What? How did you... Sandy kraken shall see you on the battlefield. My back! Thanks to Ninefer and thee. Hey, thou made it this far on your own. That's badass. True. Now thou hast made one tricked out ride. No doubt. Now let's rev this bad girl up and go take the crown. Hmm. <sighs> 
Bosonius, our spies report. House Phoenix is going to attack Castle Kraken. Gather the troops. I come at once. Yo, you built this? It's like you created the fort of my childhood dreams. What's going on? I have gathered ye here to defend our home. Gwendolyn Firebird means to strike us at our heart. She can destroy everything we've built, but I will still defeat her. Wait, what? Gwen's trying to break your fort? Aye. She is a menace of the highest order. Not cool. How can I help? Huzzah! Our bard have joined our side. All hail, DJ! Uh... Kaviticus! Hail Kaviticus! Now, go forth and man our defenses. Sandy Kraken! I call thee out! I claim Castle Kraken in the name of House Phoenix! What? Gwendolyn fears to do it herself? She is busy assaulting Fort Thunderpump and has entrusted me to bring you to heal. She's going for the crowd today? I should have said that. Deal with these peons quickly. We must get to the crowd before her. Don't just sit there. Our hero dies. Thwart our queen! I always thought I'd die of bubonic clay! I trust you! Uh -huh. Alas! Fun times. Our queen shall lay waste to every last one of you. I'm good. My ashes in a broth. Hey, what you want? 
up when you're shooting! One go! I have been out! Thou oh. hast shown us thy hand! have breached the castle! Find and eliminate them! Uh, we... Find the infiltrators! If I get the rules... They shan't see me coming! Phoenix is trying to tear the castle down! My ashes in a brothel. Stop them from destroying the castle. They had no chance. Nice one. The infiltrators. I have been out. Oh. Phoenix is trying to tear the castle down. What's next? We beat Gwen to the crown. Get to the Bowel Ride! And then onward to battle! Bowel Ride? Is this one of those games? No! No, it is not! Onward to Fort Thunderpump! The siege is over. Surrender your crown, Dust King. No way! You failed to do the required damage in the allotted time! Ugh, damn it, Carl, you know I did more than enough damage. Do I need to get a rules check? The bowel rod? Ha! They're your problem now, Gwendolyn Firebird! Ugh. <sighs> God damn it. Armies of the Phoenix, about face! Smite that hell beast and their sandworm, too! Woo! Yeah! Ah! I am here for his crown. Huh. 
none shall pass the gate of bones. Then we shall unleash the bow growl and blow your gate asunder. Your meager beast is no match for our superior defenses. We got plus 20 siege damage. What? How? The Horn of Condor. A nice addition by House Tapehorn last year. God damn it. Mm. <sighs> the gate of bones falls to the mighty roar. Onward to the crown! My battle is lost! From here we go on foot! So, why isn't this place called Fort Duststorm? All the other forts use the house name. They have corporate sponsors. Why don't we do that? We be not sellout bitches, DJ Kaviticus. The king must be in the keep! But how do we get over the walls? We have not the bow rod to shatter the gates. Oh, I know. We can use this ballista to fly us over the walls. Uh, we be but mortals, can. Also, that would really hurt. Come on! We do crazier stuff than that all the time. I don't. The ballista's busted, but I can fix it if you keep the heat off me. Tis dangerous to stay here too long. Rush me. Surrender or face annihilation. Get down. No surprise there. We aren't being overwhelmed! I need more time. By the gods, are we lost? Let us in thy keep! Show thyself! Tapeworm! Sandy Kraken does not stand alone! Tapeworm is here in your hour of need! Let this be the hour when we draw fake guns together! To the keep! Stop hiding, you cowards! I always had it. My death. Just need a, a ye old lug nut, and this will be fixed. Uh, we stand united with the Kraken! If you want this working, get me that lug nut! Let's reload. Ready to launch! driving through the back way? That's cheating! Backstage shortcuts are against the rules! No more games. I am here for a purpose. To claim the crown that is rightfully mine. The crown will go to the one who takes it. And that will be me. I'm gonna see who's Reload. who. I'll do a fighting! Uh -huh. And with the final breath, our hero dies. Eat my bolt! Improve it. Another round. Oh. You gotta love me. I know I do. I know I got you that time. You're cheating. Anything to beat your ass. Gwen, what happened to the anal retentive by the book ass kicking buzz 
kill that I kind of respect a little sometimes. God damn it. You're right. How did I fall this far? God, you make me so crazy. Jesus, I never meant to break you. If the crown means that much to you, take it. Don't fucking patronize me. You won this time. I'll take that crown off you next year. Happy with that. Victory is mine! Blinking this name! <gasps> to the Thunder Pump Pro Room! Hey. No, please! I'll give you anything! Riches! Power! Just name your price! I come for your crown. You? A min-maxing knave? Never! The king is dead. Long live me. Move. So, are you gonna buy anything? One chocolate milk and a packet of beef jerky. I totally agree, just don't want to do it right now. Don't start now! I'm pretty good at shooting. Years of video games paid off. How's things? Man, I don't even know where to start with Cutting Edge. We don't just make clothes, we make clothes out of stuff they never made clothes out of before. Just have Edith explain it to you. The fashionistas won't work with her no more because her stuff's so freaking weird. But, you know, we got a thing. Hey, Edith. 
You need anything? Always. Now listen carefully. What I see in my mind's eye inspires my work, but the mind cannot render detail, color, or texture. That's why I must have you. Uh, have me what, exactly? Find the thing I picture in my mind, then capture its essence in a photograph. But I'm not a mind reader. Don't be absurd. I've shared with you my vision journal. The rest is up to you. Okay, but this better be worth it. Oh, I may infuriate, but I never disappoint. What? Your photos are so hot, I am melting. Marvel of material engineering. Anyone can express a dog.
delicious. I can smell the rubber from here. The Saints have no history. My abuela's gonna kill me. See what I see. A brilliant future. This ten years until my awful son. I'll run. KFADR. drinks about feeling. Keep looking. I may do a trick. A haunting image, my dear. I feel the chill of death passing by.
sweet. Finders keepers. Oh! Bingo. Call me later, all right? Got used to the old gangs. Now we got you. Oh, hell no. Yes! My stream has over 50. Kind of a big deal. Now this I like. You want to tell I just fought. Good talking to you. I gotta do another nature. Could this be any more stupid? Only scrubs play charge characters. I want to study abroad. Prostitutes and drugs are illegal. All right! Next time I see him, there'll be hell to pay. Maybe I don't try this again. More saints, more problems. Ah, oh, there's my prickly paramour. Flash, Santo Ileso. Multiple eyewitnesses report that a Marshall fighter plane unleashed a barrage of missiles over Smelterville, causing millions of dollars in property damage. While denying responsibility for the incident, a Marshall spokesperson assured investigators they would have the company's full cooperation. Star Register News Network, Juana Villalobos reporting.
Uh-uh. Our work is never finished, only abandoned. But hate the asshole. You better be buying us food later. Yeah. So are the saints in your religious? I should volunteer more often. You have read my mind. A confrontation between the Purple Shirt Mafia and the Purple Shirt Mafia Task Force resulted in spilled drinks and property damage at Lancelot's Casino in Elf. I'm commandeering your vehicle. Like the kidney stone of an angel.
your pictures speak to me, my dear? We're way up high. It's a long way down. How small we are in our own little world. I hope the crab gave you no trouble, my dear. Told you I'm going to crab. Mind if I keep this? It's a long way down. Let's get down to business.
your camera brings my visions to life. Cha-ching! Hey! Finders keepers! I can put this to good use. This is the best! How sad. Broken glass and broken dreams. You have captured my visions perfectly. Return to me. Going my way. Whoops, I'm late for a meeting. This doesn't.
fuck him up! Dateline. Santo. Ileso. The Kavanaugh County Sheriff's Office has confirmed that a large explosion reported by eyewitnesses in Cranston was in fact a laboratory for the production of methamphetamine. The chemical cookery was housed in a recreational vehicle, moved from a nearby trailer park by persons unknown. The lab exploded behind ringers on Route 66. Drop. Our collection is complete. The cutting edge fashion foundry is now fully operational. I'm just quietly annoyed with everything right now. That's a... Saints coming from. Oh. Can't take all of us.
always had it. Nothing better than this. Hey, I just got word. The police chief and her task force are making another move. They're trying to get a search warrant for the church. The church? Fuck that. It's time to put an end to this task force. The police chief doesn't have the warrant yet, so we still have time to stop her. You got a plan? Yeah. I'm thinking we have a little talk and convince her to drop the investigation. And by convince her, you mean scare the shit out of her, right? Yep. We're gonna borrow Hawk's helicopter for this one. Do a little good cop, bad cop? Sure. Got a preference? Wait, you're letting me choose? I chose last time, remember? Oh, on the skeezy pizzeria job. Right, right, right. Is it weird that I want to be the bad cop? Why is it weird to want the fun role? It's kind of your thing. Do it, Eli. Be the heel. Yes! All that practice in the mirror is about to pay off. always takes a smoke break in the car. When we find the car, we find her. Really? She smokes that much? It's actually quite alarming. You worried about her health? No, her finances. Seven bucks a pack? Twice a day? I mean, that's over five grand a year. If she'd invested that instead of setting it on fire and sucking it in her lungs, you know. You are a different kind of cat, Eli. Here's her car. Smoke stacks. 
Do your worst. You're still going down. Nope, you're going down when we drop you from 10,000 feet. Hey, good cop. Shit, right? Sorry. Ouch! You kill me, the FBI comes in and eats you for lunch. You ready for that kind of heat? Heat? You want heat? off our back. We really dodged the bullet. Eli, you don't have to dodge bullets when you're covered in Kevlar. Are you telling me you were never worried about them? Ever? No. I'm saying I should get full body armor. Like full eyes, face, butthole. It works. Let's just get back to building our criminal empire. Without interference. Sure thing. The sky's the limit now, buddy. What's up? Nobody ever listens to my ideas. Hey, this is cool. Cavanaugh County, we're coming at you live all the way from Cactus World Headquarters in beautiful Santo Aliso. That's right, you're listening to KAKTS, dominating the airwaves with 9 million gigawatts of pure pistol packing radio power. It's me, Jack, the Cactus King, sovereign of the Saguaro Prince of the Prickly Pear, humbly at your service. Come on over and say hello. Hey, what can I do for you? Just checking in. Making sure Jack ain't up to his old tricks, huh? Old tricks? Interference with cell transmissions. That's what it says on my rap sheet. You can do that? Sure. Got everything I need right here. So if I'm in a fight and someone calls for backup, you can block the call? Ah, it's only a federal offense. Then <laughs> shit. Let's do it. Huh? Well, hold on. We gotta map the cell towers first. Figure out which calls are going where. Okay. But how? Well, say you wanna fuck with the idols. First thing you're gonna do is call them up and call them out. Make them come at you hard. So when they call for backup, you trace the call? Exactly. Keep the fight up long enough, I can map the whole network. And then what? And then you get up in each tower and plant one of these jammers they'll give you. On the tower? Like, at the top? How do I get up there? I don't know. But up ain't the hard part. It's down that's gonna kill you.
going to more often. Get out. Santo Ileso Police Department. Hey, come arrest me. What's your location? I'll send you a map. Don't move. We're on our way. K-A-K-T-S. Jack, it's the cops. All right, remember, make them call for backup. That's how I'll find the towers. Oh, 
have no chance. out all the police towers. You got enough jammers? Yeah, I think so. Put a jammer on each tower, block any calls to the cops.
Next Boot Hill match is streaming. What am I supposed to do here? I will avenge you. Ooh, so many pretty colors.
Gravestone decades in advance. Me a lot of money. I played every game in the series. Bravo, my dear. What a treasure you are. Stop now. Still got it. Yo, what's up? This is Trippy Red coming at you on Flex 103.5 KGRLL, where the future of rap is right here, right now. I wonder what this belongs to.
Marshals in charge. You can help. Uh, yeah, too easy. No. Tonight! I just want to make partner. Love the view. Long way down. this. Isn't it cactuses? Doesn't make sense. Oh, 
I like your style. Bingo. Looky here. Look what I found. And don't fuck around. Gang population is on the rise. What do you want? I want you to bow down before me, dipshit, because I'm your new god. God's dead, and so are you. Good. Here's where to find me. On my way. Cactus Jack here. Ready for the idols? You gotta keep those phone lines ringing. Now we need more calls. <laughs> 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 
Got it. Get in the way of freedom! Towers are on the map. Need any of those jammers? Nope, got plenty. Stick one of those bad boys on each tower, and we'll shut down any idol who calls in for backup. I can't keep up with all these new groups. The one and only Roxy Pipkin. I've got the ultimate garage rock hits to keep you amped while you hit the open road on KFBZZ 103.3 Overdrive. 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 Overdrive.
target. Dateline, Santo, Ileso. Canadian authorities deny allegations that the province of Quebec is operating a spy ring in Cavanaugh County. Just what I wanted. Check this out. go for a gordita. Thanks for warming the seat for me. Sweet. 
check this out. Finders keepers. Don't seem too bad. Got it. this? Your worst nightmare. Where are you, asshole? Come find me. You're fucking dead. Cactus radio. Jack, those Panteros are coming at me. Good. Keep them coming. The more they call for backup, the faster I map those towers. Good. Hey Jack, 
find those towers yet? About halfway there. Don't back off. how the saints do it. Still got him. Stick a jammer on each of those towers, and we can block any Pantero's call for backup. Bullseye!
Oh, dear God. Hit. Thank you very much. Not today. They work for that new startup.
That truck's supposed to be here. Right there. Warming the seat for me. Here we go! Marshall Defense Industries. Hey, remember me? I used to work for you assholes. Now, I run the Saints. Oh, it's you. You know, people around here are pretty pissed off for all the shit you pull. Wanna settle some scores? Here's where to find me. Hell yeah. Lots of folks here looking for payback. More the merrier. See you soon. K-A-K-T-S. We've got Jack on the line. Marshall's on their way. All right. Get them good and fired up so they call for backup.
On it. Don't go easy on him now.
too easy. Yeah, I'm good. Once you hit all those towers, we can jam any marshal call for backup. Quite the statement piece. It's a long way down.
Please, not this today! Newsflash. Santo Ileso. The idols are suspected in the murder of District Attorney... We're way up high. It's a long way down. Love the view. There's a car there. 
This moment is yours. Trying to drive here. Silence. We're way up high. Yes! Why don't you swing by the station? We can celebrate. Love the view. We're way up high. job then I'm not truly an artist next time buy your own enchiladas got a large cluster of problems right now hey Jack what's up just ran the diagnostics all jammers are present and accounted for that'll give us a few more seconds on the clock no don't tell the FCC I already did my time 
just got me an upgrade. Gotta fill my quota. Looks like more trouble in town. I'm feeling this. This shit better move soon. Newsflash, Santo Ileso. Explosive developments at City Hall as citizens are calling for a ban on rocket-propelled grenade launchers after recent incidents of mayhem, including a frenzied battle at Meeker Square. A spokesperson for the mayor's office stated the city council is now drafting an anti-ordinance ordinance to combat the issue. Reporting for the start... Thank <laughs> you. 
Hey, you busy? I need your help with something. It's really important. I'm here. What's up? We need to get over to FB's ASAP. They're re-releasing the Mecha Burger. The what? The toy. Don't you remember? It looks like a hamburger, but turns into a robot. Limited edition re-release. Let's go. You know, I think I had a Mecha Burger way back when. Everybody had one the summer I was nine. It was the most popular kids meal toy FB's ever produced. And you want to relive your childhood. Sure. No problem. Oh, shit. Do you think they're all here for the Mecha Burger? Doesn't matter if they are. We can just muscle up to the head of the line. Welcome to FB's. Can I take your order? Uh, yes. Hi. May I please have a chicken brat box meal with a Mecha Burger toy? In purple, if you have it. We're out of Mecha Burgers. Shit. Well, there's another FB's in Marina Del Lago. Let's try there. The Marina's FB's is also out. The next closest is a Mercado. And there are two in the flats, but we should try Mercado first. Dude, why is it so important to get a new one of these? Oh, I didn't have an old one. I never got one when I was a kid. It came out when I was in foster care. So. Oh, right. Let's get you a fucking Mecha Burger. What the hell are the idols doing here? Being pretentious anarchists and getting in everybody's way? What else? Well, they're between me and my kid's toy, so let's fix that. Still got it. here needs a chicken kids meal with a mecha burger toy in purple they're all gone those horrible people in pink stole the entire shipment they said something about striking a blow against capitalistic materialism and soggy french fries fucking idols they really are a bunch of thugs taking joy from children fuck children they took joy from you buckle up There they are. Get them to pull over. Not sure whether to ram or shoot. Whatever. Just don't blow up the delivery car.
so cool you're doing this for me. I like your style. Just don't destroy the Mega Burgers. There. You are now the proud owner of 500 limited edition Mecha Burgers. Nah, I just want one. But maybe sometime you could help me bring the rest down to the county orphanage? Absolutely. I wonder if I still have that old Santa Claus costume somewhere. Doesn't that costume have a shirt? Not when I wear it, baby. Hey man, you busy tonight? I'm at the gym. It's leg day. Why? I was gonna make popcorn and binge watch telenovelas till dawn. Yes, we can finally find out who killed Corazon. I'll meet you at the church as soon as I'm done here. You just waking up? Telenovela binge last night. Kev was supposed to join, but he stood me up. That doesn't sound like Kev. Plus, he left his inhaler here, and he's not answering my texts. You think he's okay? I'm sure he's fine. I can run the inhaler to him anyway. Without interrupting anything, I hope. I'm tracking his phone. Huh. Looks like he's at the snake oil salon. The biker bar? Oh, maybe he's back with Tattoo Mom again. Oh, I liked her. I know, right? Come on, Kevin. Pick up. Yes? Oh, hey. You're not Tattoo Mom. Uh, I was looking for Kevin. Yeah, man, Kevin is, uh, shall we say, a little tied up at the moment. Wow, I did not need that detail. I'm just gonna drop this off. Wait a minute. Kev's not the fun kind of tied up. Those fucked! <laughs> Where the fuck is Kevin? Kevin ain't here, so fuck off. Fuck you, Saint. Fuck you, Saint. Tell me where he is. Finally. It's me, Eli. The idols got Kevin. Shit. 
All right, I'll track their socials and see what I can find. Great. I'll work the problem from my angle. Walk away! Oh, I still need one to interrogate. Gotta go. Now, I'll get you in. It doesn't have to be a date date. Someone's in there. Yes, I'm on the can. So? Someone in here! Fuck off! Anything I want except Kevin's location. You don't understand. They'll kill me if I talk. Suit yourself. This is sick. What is wrong with you? Anything on the socials? Yeah, some big idols party at a mansion and a, a timer counting down. Let me guess. A mansion by the Santa Waliso sign. I'm headed there now. The collective is behind it. I might need backup. Kev's all the backup I'll need. All right. Bring him home. Time to beat your ass! I don't have time to fuck around. Nice one. This idol's gonna beat your ass. Come on, come on. Faster, faster.
No distractions. Just get to Kev. I'm coming for you, buddy. Nutjobs rig bombs all the way up? Okay, remember your martial training. Ah! I'm ready for a brawl! <laughs> Kevin's gonna collection. send a message sky high! Look at you, pathetic. Running like a hamster so intent on the wheel that it never sees its cage. Kevin saw the cage once, but he chose to stay nested in his wood chips. Now he pays the price. Halfway there. You fuckers think you can stop me now? Here we go. I can do this. I cut this wire. The collective needs me elsewhere. Ooh. Stick around with the show. Ah! You have no vision. I got that shot. Ah! Steady hands, steady hands. Ah! Ah! You want to get to the top? You got to get past. How fast you run now, little hamster? Did she just speed up the timers? God damn. Idols, time to flee or become martyrs. The freedom to choose, as always, is yours. Kevin? Over here! I'll do that. Kev! Oh man, am I glad to see you. Let me deal with this last bomb and we'll get out of here. Damn it. I should have waited for you on the telenovelas. So, who killed Corazon? Oh shit. Her spirit possessed the priest and then testified that her evil twin... Never mind. We'll rewatch them together. There. That's the last bomb. Wow. You saved me. You're like, literally my hero. What now? Now I say we wingsuit down to that mansion and teach those motherfucking motherfuckers what happens when they kidnap a saint. Be the motherfucking way. you were hoping for, huh? There. 
anarchist fuck nuts. I always had it. All of them? Yep. Oh, thanks for the rescue. I really owe you one. Ah, forget it, man. We're family. The idol said they were my family, too. Well, some families tie you to a chair so they can watch you explode, and others don't. Yeah. Thanks for being the second kind. Nina? Is that you? The fucking Pantero stole my fucking car! Your project car? Yes! This is Sergio stink all over it! I need your help! I'm getting my car back, with interest! On my way. Let's go get my car back. You want the wheel? And try not to drive angry. So... Any idea where they took your car? If they stole it, they're gonna chop it. But you know Sergio. I wanna make it personal first. Take it for a spin, drag racing. Show the Pantero to his boss. Most likely place to do that is at the culvert in Smaltadil. Hopefully we can catch him there before he carves it up. He knows what that car means to me. Damn. I don't know if I ever said this in so many words, but that guy is a world-class crap sack. You spent hours on that car. I've spent years on that car. That's why he took it. As far as he's concerned, I didn't betray Los Panteros. I betrayed him. He's gotta make it hurt. I don't get it. If someone betrayed me, I just, you know, pew. Not that I want him to do that to you, I just, it seems easier. That's not how it works in Los Panteros. You shoot someone in the face, they're dead. You fuck up their car, they're nothing. Oh, fuck. Here's the culvert. They aren't going to be happy to see you. Whatever. As long as I get my car. Oye, cabrones! ¿Dónde está mi carro? Shit! It's Nina! I'm good. You got no place here anymore! Tell her what she wants to know. Big mistake, Nina! Should've just let it go!
still got it. You really want to die over her old car? Barbecue time! I don't see your car. Damn it! It's not here. You must already be chopping it. We've got to get to the garage. What if we're too late? Sergio's people are professionals. Cut it up clean so they can sell it for parts. So you could rebuild it then? Eventually. Doesn't mean I won't take it out of their ass for putting me through the trouble. Hola, Gabriel. Where's my car? It's not here. No digas pendejadas. We both know you chopped Sergio's special project. I don't think he's gonna talk. He's our only fucking lead. Wait, what did you say about Los Panteros? Shoot one in the face and they're dead, but fuck up their car and they're nothing. Wait, what? Oh, my paint job, my fucking paint job! You don't fuck with a man's grill, you, you just don't! Oh, you know what I paid for that hood ornament? My car! What are you doing? Okay, okay, I'll talk. Sergio took your car to the quarry. What? Oh no, 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 no! We gotta go, we gotta go now! Drive now to the quarry! I don't get it. What's that mean? What's the quarry? It means Sergio doesn't want to chop my car. He doesn't even want to sell it for scrap. You mean he's gonna... Right over the edge. There's no fixing that. We don't stop him. That crap, Zach. Hang on. We got all kinds of Panteros up our ass. anything slow you down. Getting close. Step on it.
I drove that car all the way here from Guadalajara. My family's so far away, you know. It felt like I was keeping part of them with me. She never let anyone else drive that car. Who? My mom. But when Kimo made her weak, I drove her around. Ah, oh, fuck. I promised her I'd take care of that car. Ella confiaba en mí. Let's go. We can still catch up to him. Nah. If Sergio's gonna fuck with my family, I'm gonna fuck with his. I'll follow that damn GPS. It's me. Time to pay Sergio back for what he did to my car. I have a plan, but I need you to get me into the Scorpion factory. That's Pantero's HQ. Oh, give me a sec, give me a sec. Got it. Meet me at the FBs in Mercado. Let those things are making the same. This is Roxy Pipkin, and you're listening to KFBZZ 103.3 Overdrive. So, you said you've got a plan? Yep. I'm gonna blow up all their cars and destroy the forge so they can't make more. Uh... How, exactly? Today's the first Wednesday of the month, barbecue day. Everybody will be outside for lunch. The factory will be almost deserted, except for the cars. We get in, go through the garage, torching everything with wheels. You take care of anybody who might try to stop us. Then, when we get to the forge, I know where they keep the oxyacetylene tanks for welding. That stuff's explosive as fuck. You hold them off while I roll the tanks right down its throat. Boom, no more forge. Damn, that is a plan. The best part is, Sergio's out on a collection run. By the time he even hears about it, it'll be too late. How are we gonna get inside the Scorpion factory? By liberating a helicopter from the aerial gun range. The what now? It's a tourist thing. They run out helicopters with machine gun turrets, then fly them over the desert and shoot... I don't know, whatever is out there to shoot. This is for fucking real. I know, right? Fine. If stealing a tourist assault helicopter gets me inside the factory, whatever. I do know a guy I could borrow one from, but his rates are pretty high. Hey, you need a ticket! Fuck this, man! So, this forge thing we're blowing up. It's the giant furnace Los Panteros use to make all the custom gear and weapons and bling for their cars. Ah, that'll cut Sergio off at the knees. It'll do more than that. 
forge is symbolic. It's power and protection and home and hearth. Everything Los Banderos are supposed to be about. Forget his needs. We're gonna rip out his heart. Day. Just like I said, didn't expect an aerial assault on your lunch break, did ya? Hey, reinforcements. They look like ants from up here. I brought you along. Looks like there's guards on the roof. Take them out, too. That's it! Show them who's boss! Fun time. We'll get inside. We'll have to go in through the vent. We're in. Let's blow some shit up. Fuck up their cars and they're nothing, right? Exactly. You wreck my car, I wreck all your fucking cars. Nina, not to nitpick, but didn't your plan call for this place to be deserted? It should have been. You must be working double shifts. You look at all this gear. That's very good. I something big. Well, we're taking care of that.
Holy shit. Sergio's monster truck. Didn't I destroy that thing? I told you, Sergio can use the forge to build anything. Oh! Oh. I had a plan. But this'll be better. Come with me to the control booth! I'm gonna need the crane. Crane? Your plan didn't include a crane. I would have remembered a crane. Power up that console! It's not working. Shit, you have to activate the junction box. It's down there, next to the oxyacetylene tank. Nina, what's the play here? No time to explain. You trust me? Always. Then do it. Drop power to the crate. Cover me. I said I was going to wreck all their cars, and I fucking meant it. Let's show them how the saints do it. No <laughs> surprise there. <laughs> Look, the electricity died. I need you to reset the power relay. I always had it. of crazy. Now, what was your exit plan? I planned that you'd improvise. I trust you too. Oh, okay then. Follow me. What's this? Crush test truck. You mean exit plan. Can you get that car working? What kind of question is that? Watch my back.
Don't forget, it's game night tonight. Shit, yeah. It's not my turn to get snacks, is it? After those Marmite-flavored potato chips you brought last time, I don't think we're ever letting you get snacks again. I don't like it, Eli. Yeah, no doubt. This fucker's hogging all the sloths. I'm talking about what we're paying the crew. Psh, you mean what we're not paying the crew? <sighs> Bullets and 401ks are expensive. There's a bunch of ways we can get some quick cash. Nina can boost some cars, I'll do hits, Kev can run a bake sale. I'm not sure that's gonna work. Look, man, I know I normally do savory, but I can bake the shit out of some macaron. Meerkat me. Look, if you want insured salary kill bots, we need to bring in a lot more cash. All right, so what? We rob a bank? No. We rob a train. I don't know where this is going, but it sounds like my kind of stupid. Okay, you know how banks have federal requirements for how much cash they need to keep on hand? No. Well, they do. And since the economy in Santo Ileso has skyrocketed, they have to keep bringing in more money to meet the minimums. And let me guess. They move it in by train. It's really more of a mobile fortress. Oh, good. How do you know so much about this? Sergio talked about wanting to hit it every time it rolled into town. But you guys never made a play for it? We never had enough hardware. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. The forge. That's what they were gearing up for. Oh, so the impossible to rob train is going to be attacked by the Panteros as well. Cool. Look, I'm not saying it would be easy, but we have time to plan. Oh, and Kev. I'm taking your wallabies for the win. <laughs> uh, Damn it. Yes! Okay, so it's a tough job. Let's get some extra muscle. A top tier murder machine to help me out. You have someone in mind? I do. Someone I met during my stint at Marshall. It'll be a tough sell, but I bet we can persuade him. Cool, let's give him a call. Can't do that. Uh, why? He's being detained in a privately owned prison called the Frontier. You want to break out the Nawali, don't you? Assuming he hasn't been extrajudicially murdered by now, yes? What can go wrong? I mean, I could die. But let's be positive. Coming up on the frontier. Shit, that place is a fucking fortress. I'm gonna stay low to avoid detection. We're gonna have to find a way to do the same. You know, maybe actually be stealthy for once. Hey, I can be stealthy. That's why I dug out my old Marshall uniform, to blend in. I'm like a total stealth pro. Seriously? You used a hand grenade to open a bottle of beer. That was one time! On the roof. Stay in the air. I'll be out with our new recruit in no time. 10 4. I'm in. Need to remember to stealth. Keep moving, and don't let any guards get a good look at your face. If they do, I'll bluff my way through. I got this. Hey, I don't recognize you. Yeah, this is my first night shift. Keep moving. Don't give them time to think about it. Attention guests! A reminder that all constitutional protections are suspended on frontier property, pursuant to Congressional Secret Act number 88. Are you new? Okay, I'm gonna make quick contact with the Nawali, then keep going to the control room to disable the lock on his cell. Make it fast. I don't know how long I can hold this position.
haven't had a shift together in ages. We'll have to catch up after. You lost, rookie? See, I can so stealth. You know what stealthy people don't do? Squawk about how stealthy they are. Yeah, yeah. VIP cells just down here. Hey, I don't know you. I don't know you either. It's a big company. Hey, wanna get out of here? You? You put me in here. Career change. Got a job in mind for you. Sit tight. Doing it here. Passing through to meet my CO. How are you getting into the control room? I'm gonna walk in like I own the place and press the button. That seriously does not count as stealthing. Does if it works. Evening. What are you doing? Orders. Whose orders? I give it. Wait a minute. You're the one who got fired because of that museum fiasco. Fuck. I always had it. Warning. Guard down. Implementing lockdown. Double fuck. Gotta get out of here. Maybe busting the servers? Go help the Nawali. Back up to the backup security cell. Back up now. Wow. We should go. What makes you think there is a we? If there's not, you'll never know why I risked breaking you out. Very well, lead on. Okay, Nina, you were right. I suck at stealth. I'm gonna do my thing now. You mean shoot your way out. I mean shoot my way out. Go ah! oh, me. Locked. So we kill all the guards in this room. They'll have to open the door to send reinforcements. Good call. <laughs> and here I thought I was following you. I'm the best for a reason. Prisoners. Kill the dog. Don't make me take the kid gloves off. We need reinforcements. Me? Lock it down. That'll teach you the cattle fraud. It was always going to come to me. Everyone on the ground. Ah! 
Now, no can do. You started a prison riot. The whole place is lit up like a Christmas tree. I can't get anywhere close. Okay, change the plans. Down instead of up. We'll steal a car. Hmm. Careless, but opportunistic. Interesting. <gasps> they have no chance. Surprise there. So much for going out the front. Nina, you got eyes on an escape route? <sighs> Can't see anything. They're chasing me out of the airspace. Oh, so you only planned half a rescue. Get the servers back up! There! We're out of the prison. And how will you get out of the canyon? Uh, to the left! Which is taking us back to the prison. Shit. No, we can drive across the roof. I plan exactly. I will. Whew! That was fun, huh? You hungry? <sighs> Thanks for stopping. Figured you could use a good meal. Okay. Good's a little generous. All right, it's a lot generous. But I'm willing to bet it's better than what they serve you in the frontier. I appreciate it. And my freedom. Even if you're the one who put me there. Oh, shit. Is this gonna be a problem? I know what it feels like to be judged for following orders. Sounds like a hell of a story. It is. You wanna tell me? We're not friends. We could be. I should go. Need a ride? No, no. It will be nice to walk. But thank you for offering. Call me when you're ready to talk about the job.
this thing with the Nawali works out, because we really kicked the hornet's nest on this one. What do you mean? I mean, Marshall is out in force. They've set up checkpoints and roadblocks all over the west side of town, looking for you and the Nawali. I could stay ahead of Marshall. Are you sure? Because from what I hear, they have orders to shoot you on sight. Careful! Snake bites are no joke around here. Hey, did you bring the packages in? What packages? One's by the front door. Shit, I think someone stole them. Oh, fuck no. I'll be right there. Kevin, run me through what happened. I got a delivery notification text with a picture of some packages by the door, but by the time I went to get them, they were gone. The mail carrier can't have gotten far. Let's track them down and see what happened. Can I help you? You just delivered packages to the old mission church. What happened to him? One of your people took him. Some fella wearing pink. Pink? It's the fucking idols. They stole our shit. Which way did they go? They ran off over there. did we order anyway? Maybe it's my Crucifix workout DVD? I want to get me some Jesus abs. I hate workout fads. Hey, fuckers! Give us back our boxes! Get out boxes now, asshole! is full of knives. Oh, right. It's the knives Nina and I ordered off that infomercial. I hope the number of knives isn't a measure of how upset you were. What? No. The guy on TV was just a really good salesman. Come to think of it, there should be way more boxes than this. They might be nearby. Let's check the alley. Hey, where the hell are my boxes? Fuck you, boxes! Where my FBs? I've been waiting for you assholes to bring me my nugs! Why don't we check the FBs? Nugs do sound good. So, uh, why'd you buy so many knives? I mean, this seems a bit excessive. Eh, retail therapy. You look for something to make you feel better, one knife leads to another, and boom. You've got, like, a billion knives. Fuck. I'm... I'm sorry I made you guys so mad. I, I didn't mean to... Whoa, whoa, Kev. We were never mad at you. We were just upset about the situation. Also, we really like knives. We even got you one. Ah! Nice one. Yeah, we're still missing some. Seriously? I guess there's an idol's hangout we can check out. There. That's all the knives we ordered. Look, Kev, that one's for you. 
Oh my god, is that an Oni chef's knife? You guys are the best. <laughs> Another company meeting coming up to discuss the uh, training program. Just call it a train heist. Nobody's listening. Can we at least pretend operational security is a. Never mind. It's your turn to get donuts. Fine. I'm on it. Oh, it's those seats I've been hearing about. I need this more than you. Of course there's a line. Hey Nina, grabbing donuts for the meeting. Any preferences? Ooh, give me the special. You want me to check what it is first? It's a donut and it's special. What else do I need to know? Hey Kev, picking up donuts. Want anything? Oh man. I should probably avoid the carbs. I thought it was cheat day. That's Tuesdays. Yeah, we which donut place. Maybe I'll make an exception. Holy cow, it's you! Oh mama, it's my lucky day! The fuck? What was that? You okay? Yeah. Some rando just attacked me. Kids! I saw them first! Shit, there's more! Fun times. It's my kill. Money, money, money! What the hell's going on? Sounds like you're... 
Oh shit, yeah, you're on the Wanted app. I'm what? Anybody in town could be trying to kill you for the bounty. Stay there. I'm on my way. Just stay there. Next time, Eli buys the donuts. Looks like my shit has finally come in. Thought this was gonna be easy money, huh? You're gonna make me still die. Everyone's trying to break into the murder biz these days. That bounty's mine. Fucking amateurs. I'm almost out front. Don't worry, I've got a plan. Get in! Hurry! Any idea who might have put you on Wanted? Take your pick. Marshall, the Idols, Los Panteros, somebody's widow or orphan. Right. Pretty sure I've got a former college roommate who might have done it. Well, whoever it is has money. The bounty they set is huge. Holy shit! I'd almost off myself for that money. Is that my DMV pick? Good. One whole move. So what's your plan? Is it better than me murdering my way through every wannabe killer in town? It is. I'm taking you to my buddies, Hank and Claude. They designed the Wanted app. They can take you off in. You sure? Yeah, they're cool. They brought the gig economy to murder for hire. Well, it started as a dating app, but the market was so crowded, you know? I'm glad they found their niche. Oh! Happy with that. So, how do you know these two hacker guys? They wanted, back when it was a dating app. You dated one of them? Both. We had a really special week together. Fun times. Holy shit! Someone set up a roadblock! Another roadblock. These guys are getting serious. I'm good. We bring the party. There's their house. We're almost out of this. Hank! Claude! Hi, Kev! What a pleasure. I need a favor. My friend ended up on your Wanted app and needs to get taken off. Oh, I'm sorry. We never curate user content on the Wanted app. Corporate policy! Yeah? How about I put you two jokers on the app? Wait, what? Uh, we got more users incoming. We'll hold them off if you two clean up this mess. Uh, motion to amend corporate policy? Second! All in favor? Aye! Motion passes! Hurry! Take us all off! Sorry for putting a hit out on your friends there, Kev. Nah, they were kind of asking for it. Let's show them how the Saints do it! Killing people for money is harder than I thought! I yeah, run too easy. You really it, huh? How's it going back there? I just need to update the database. I think you mean reinitialize the server? The posts are in the database, but the server is what pushes them. I'm gonna fucking die over this? The gig economy works, fool. Uh. I've been asking 
Nice one. Okay, it's done. The ponies are canceled. Looks like they're backing off. You know, I'm thinking maybe the Saints ought to take that app off your hands. For everyone's safety. You mean, like a bio? Sure. Cool. We own the water app now. Yeah, but we're super late for Eli's meeting. I could do this forever. For real, though, that food gave me the shit. It's me. I'm waiting. Are we going to plan this train robbery or not? I was just about to call you. It's time to start preparing. Meet me at the church. Finally. Sorry about not being able to connect the other day. A whole lot of people tried to kill me, so I had to, you know, murder the shit out of them and... Well, time got away from me. Eh, it happens. You meet the rest of the crew yet? No, I was waiting for you. Well, let's meet him. Hey everyone, I'd like to introduce you to the Nawali. He's here to make our train robbing dreams a reality. It's nice to meet you, sir. I'm Eli. I'm Kevin. Everyone calls me Kev. You're not wearing a shirt. Less shirt, more power. I'm not sure that's how it works. Yeah, don't try to figure it out. I'm Nina. It's nice to meet you. Yes, a pleasure. So, shall we plan the heist? No. I thought you called me here because you wanted to prepare for the robbery. Correct. So we are planning the heist? Mm, no. Okay, I must admit, I'm confused. What are we doing? Team building. What? Look, you don't know us, we don't know you. But we're putting our lives in each other's hands, so we need to be on the same page. Eli threw out the idea that we should spend a day doing some team building exercises. You know, so we can really get a sense of camaraderie. We have hats. I thought we agreed to use the fleur. This is better. I'm with Nina. I have so many questions. And that, my friend, is what team building is all about. Check it out. The best RV money can rent. Shotgun! Everyone get in! Well, this vehicle is well stocked with beer, but I don't see any guns. Nope. No guns today. So, it's to be knife work, then. What? No, we're just gonna have a regular, non-murdery bonding day with friends. Everybody gets to choose one activity they want to do. And then, we all go do it. Hmm. I'm up first. And I brought the spray paint. I know a place in Mercado that's just begging for a saint's mural. Isn't that Pantero's turf? All the more reason. All right. We get to see the magic happen. So we are engaging in common vandalism. Excuse me? Oh, whoa. It's not vandalism. It's art. Damn right it is. Art made illegally. With spray paint. Look, Nina's really good. It'll be an awesome mural for everyone to enjoy. You'll see. Are you sure we shouldn't be planning the heist? Yes. I plan today to be just for fun.
Why don't we cut the tension with a little dubstep? I'd rather hear some ranjera. What are you talking about? When they finally drop the bass, the relief is infectious. We could ask our guest what he likes. Roger McGillicuddy has this amazing new podcast. Nope. Uh -uh. I'd rather no not. No way. Here we go. Not a bad example of my orange period, but I can do better now. Let's put some morado in Mercado. This is what you do? Painting? I thought you were criminals. No. I mean, yeah. I mean, this is Pantero's turf. Nina ran with them before we started the Saints. So for her to be here, putting up our colors... Ah, she's showing defiance in the face of her enemies. This, I understand. Uh, shit. We got Pantero's incoming. I thought we'd be out of here before they found us. I'm not stopping now. Cover me. But it's a murder-free day. Oh, damn it. Thanks for getting rid of those assholes. Now I can get down to business. And done. Damn, Nina. Another masterpiece. Agreed. Now that I understand the context, it is impressive work. Now that there's no one left to kill, we can get back to having fun. Back to the RV. Oh, who's up next? Me. I have found a new bar on Atcha. It's got five stars, a huge tequila selection, and karaoke! Oh man, it's been ages since we've done karaoke. And hey, Wally, what's your karaoke song? I do not sing with strangers. Then it's good we're friends now, isn't it? I guess anything but Love Shack. Love Shack? We haven't done Love Shack since Ghost Pepper Night. Kevin, we do not talk about Ghost Pepper Night. I made ghost pepper chili. It was too spicy. They were not ghost peppers. They were demon peppers. I spent two fucking days in the bathroom. I got something in my eye. It was bad. All right. Let's get this party kicking. Ah, apart from the karaoke, this is my kind of place. Well done, Eli. Barkeep, I need five tequilas, the karaoke book, and a plate of your best flautas. Marshal security, we're looking for... Holy shit, the Nawalis! Call the strike team, quick! Fuck, we better stop them. I know, I know. Better run before that strike team gets here. Too late. Fight our way out. Damn it. This is not how this is supposed to go. Did you really think we were going to? Seriously, Marshall has cover bites now? So cool. Uh, they would be very useful for the train heist. We are not discussing the. Th I'm changing my activity. Let's steal a hover bike and race it at jet ski point. Fair. You and the Nawali grab the bike. We'll meet you there. Why do you seem to hate your job so much? What? I don't hate my job. You are a professional cold-blooded killer like me, no? 
And yet, you do not wish to fight on your off hours. You know, when you love what you do, you never work a day in your life. Look at your friend, Kevin. Everything he does, he does with gusto. Hey, I murder with gusto. I just... Don't you ever want a day off? A killcation? No. Oh. Let's maybe keep that bit from Eli, huh? Clear. Let's have some good, clean fun with this baby, huh? Lead on. Just keep point below to the idols! Non-believers not welcome! Kev, what the hell? This place is crawling with idols. Yeah, that's how I know the spot. The Reese Jetski's here. This is not the plan, Kevin. Oh. Oh. There are no chance. Looks like there are more that way. They do well for the... Kill to have us dead it. Are we done? Can we joyride in peace now? You bet. Come on back and we can... Oh, shit. There's more marshal rolling up. I guess we didn't shake him after all. <sighs> we'll be right there. We gotta get out of here. know a place, a safe house, where we can hide the bike and arm ourselves against our enemies. But... Insist, this is my choice. Nina, head for the old graveyard west of Panther Rock. Back off! We're fucking bonding! I 
Over here. I have weapons inside. I'll stash the hover bike. The rest of you keep watch. You, my friend. I have a special weapon you may borrow. Try it out and use it to do what you love. Ooh. Hey, thanks. Now then, shall we meet the foe on our terms? Yeah. 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 Fuck yeah. Oh, Jesus. The idols found us too. Then let's go fuck them up. Hey, everybody. I'm sorry today went to shit. I had this perfect plan, and it just went off the rails. Which makes it different from all your other plans. How exactly? Anyway, don't worry about it. Today was awesome. <laughs> it's true. I cannot recall having a more memorable time. Same here. Not since Ghost Pepper Night. Kevin, we do not speak of Ghost Pepper Night. Eh? <laughs> Come on. Hand to God. Even I think that's crazy. Hey, when you're dealing with the Aztec cartel, it's best not to ask why and just go with it. <laughs> it's getting late. I should probably get going. Thanks for dinner, Kev. It was great. Thanks, man. The marinade does all the work. You're too modest. Drive safe. Thank you. And please, make Kev wear a shirt. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see what I can do. Not gonna fucking happen. Let me walk you out. Look, I know we're kind of ridiculous, but when push comes to shove, there's no one I want more by my side than those guys. They're good people. They are. I, I guess what I'm saying is... I know you're looking at the heist as a one-and-done sort of thing. You know, a debt that you're paying off, but it, it doesn't have to be. I'll think about it. Please do. Got word. Marshall's money train is heading into town. You ready for the great train robbery? Call the Nawali. We'll meet him at the graveyard, pick up the hover bikes, and go make some bank.
right on time. So, how do you want to do this? I don't know. Drive to the train, figure out where they're keeping the dough, hop aboard, and then... kill the shit out of anyone who gets between us and our money? Sounds good. Let's move. Uh, wait. Before we go... Oh, no, I, I have a couple on me already. <laughs> Before the whole Saints thing got started, I... I got depressed and ordered a whole lot of knives. I figure if this is our only run together, you should at least get a souvenir. It's beautiful. Thank you. Let's get that money. Which car is the money on? Hard to tell from the surveillance imagery. And we hop on the back and work our way up until we find it. Whatever you say. Incoming fire! Cap! We're okay. Losing speed, though. Shit. We need the Nawali for this. Plan B. Nina, get me on the train. Then go help Kevin. You got it. Hold tight. Ah. Made it. Back there. I'm with Kev. Bikes fucked. Sorry. Nina's going to bring me up instead. Plan C. We'll be right there. Ah! I could get a performance bonus. Problem. Marshall locked the train down. I'll have to hotwire the doors. The thing I used to work for these assholes. We're close. Hang in there. Ah! Nina, stay back. They've got a turret. What is your plan now? Uh, get in close and try to hotwire it? Yeah, call that plan D. Ugh. Ugh. Unauthorized entry detected. Screw hotwiring. I can take out these control servers. System malfunction. Defense turret offline. Turret's down. You can bring in the Nawali now. Closing in. You better keep moving. Looks like they're up to something a few cars ahead. I'm good. This is a restricted area. They decoupled the train. Nina, I need a lift. I'll have to drop off the Nawali and come back for him. Do it. Is that plan E? Technically, it's plan B again. This is no time for whiteboards, Eli. I'm here. Hop on. Let's catch that train. Is that? Oh, shit. Panteros, take the train. Find the money. Kill anyone in your way. I'm gonna need the Nawali, fast. I'll drop you off and get him. What are you gonna do? I guess, plan E? Nobody robs this train but the Saints. Ah, 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 ah! Meathead think you 
can steal our heist? Sergio's still around somewhere and he's out for blood. Let him come. I'm past ready to boss battle that crap sack. Sorry if I surprised you. I thought stealth would be our ally. Yeah, no. Wow. You just killed him pretty hard. Eh, it was nothing. I know. I just kind of figured I'd be the one to... You know what? It's good. It's all good. Let's go get our money. You killed Sergio! You bastards! You are not without that. Fall back! Panteros, fall back! Ah! I'm good. Not bad. Another turret. Follow my lead. I know how to handle myself against Marshall. Detected. Let's take this sucker down! System malfunction. Defense turret offline. You do have a gift for destruction. I think I can see the church from up here. Ah! Hey, Nawali! You ever rob a train like this before? On foot, I mean. Yes, once. In the Andes. It was during a blizzard, so the footing was more treacherous. Still got it. There. Ah! Extra jet bikes. Perhaps we can use these to make our escape. Gotta find the money first. Uh, it always pays to have an escape plan. Look out! Seal the car! Split them up! No, Ollie! Are you alright? What's happening in there? We got split up. 
I lost the Nawali. Nawali! Nawali, come in! Over! Is she okay? Or do you think he failed on us? He wouldn't do that, right? I always had it. Somebody give me some good news. You're near the front. The money must be... Did they launch a helicopter? Yeah, I'm sick of this shit. I'm grabbing their tanks. You're what? I'm calling this plan F. F for fuck it. Ugh. Build a smaller train. Glad you taught me to drive one of these. Ooh. Happy with that. Welcome to Plan F, motherfucker. Something important. I'm seeing explosions all over. You better hurry. Nina, we need an evac. I'm not in position. I have to fall back. There it is. I see the money car. For once, things went as planned. Let's see how we did. That enough to cover the crew? You're goddamn right it is. <laughs> you might even have enough left over to buy some proper stemware. Then they wouldn't be mug mosas. Thanks for your help. Thanks for the knife. Think about what I said. <sighs> I will. And if you guys need anything, just call. He was a nice guy. Sad to see him go. He carved out Sergio's heart. Okay. He was an intense guy. Sad to see him go. Hey, we had a big win today. We should do something irresponsible to celebrate. What do you have in mind? Oh, I don't know. The money fight! <laughs> <laughs> what? what? <laughs> We don't almost kill Kev. I was in the moment! <laughs> you dumb son of a bitch. I am so sorry, Kevin. Buy me a stand mixer and all is forgiven. Deal. Now that Sergio's dead, I think we broke their spine. Couldn't have happened to a bigger bunch of assholes. There's hardly any of them on the streets right now. It, it probably won't last, but this is a chance to really take a bite out of their territory. Kick them when they're down, you mean? With steel-toed boots. Call me in if you decide to go for it. You better be buying us food, like...
I need a favor. Can you drive me around and pretend to be my chauffeur this afternoon? Wait, you want me to drive one of your cars? I gotta be classy today. Now that I've got money, I'm gonna buy some art from the kind of collectors who have chauffeurs. Come pick me up at the museum. I've been doing some research so I can blow them away. Be right there. Love so what it. are we buying? Three Noshoni Fisher pieces. She's my hero. She made these amazing whimsical sculptures, sheet metal welded over steel frames. I promised myself that if I ever had money, I'd buy some of her work. Okay, now keep quiet. I'm gonna call the first collector. Hello. Ah, good afternoon. I was told you're the owner of a Nishoni Fisher original. Surprise. Huh? It's a big metal apple with a rattlesnake coming out of it. Ah, uh, that piece of junk. Well, I'm a huge fan of the artist and it can make you a very attractive offer. Ah, <laughs> there is no amount of money in the world you could offer me for that. <laughs> My ex-husband bought it as an investment, and it drives him nuts that I got it in the divorce. <laughs> you cannot buy that kind of spite. <laughs> but... She hung up on me. Well, we could just take it. I don't want to take it. I want to buy it. This is my chance to be part of the art world. Legit. Look, if she didn't want to sell it because she actually loved it, it'd be one thing. But she doesn't even like it. You do. Why should she get to keep it despite you? I mean... I guess art is meant to be appreciated. Okay. Let's get it. That won't fit in the trunk. We're gonna have to tow it. Ah, it is made out of steel. Just drive careful, okay? This is not how I expected my first big art purchase to go. Let's get the next one. And this time, 
We'll do it right. Yes? Hi, I understand you're the owner of a Nishoni Fisher piece? Music of the Desert. The cactus statue. Yes. Well, like yourself, I am a collector of fine art, and I would like to buy the piece from you. I'm prepared to pay what it's worth. Oh, I don't need the money, hon. I I'm sure you don't, but... But I do need the cactus. Oh, it makes a great place to hang the kids' swimsuits on summer days. Uh, sorry. What the fuck? She's gonna rust out the frame hanging wet shit on it. That's not how you treat art. So, we'll be taking this one as well? <sighs> Looks like. Oh, it's all rusted out, just like I thought. I'll need to be extra careful driving, or it'll fall apart. I guess not everybody actually appreciates art, even in the art world. Two down, one to go. This time, we do it right for sure. Heidi, Heidi. Yes, hello. I understand you're the owner of an Ashoni Fisher piece, Moon River. It's a cow. Wait, what? That thing? Oh my god. Me and my sorority sisters stole it from outside the Santo Aliso Community Center in college. I was so drunk, I threw up on it. Ugh. Oh, fuck it. We're stealing this one, too. This piece is really fragile. Try not to destroy it on the way home, okay? Look, Nina! We interrupt the broadcast with this breaking news. The art thieves terrorizing Monte Vista have been spotted fleeing the area with a large metal cow in tow. Okay. Good news, we're part of the art world. Bad news, as art thieves. Fuck that. We are art liberators. 
Now drive. This cow handles like shit. Fuck off! My friend wants this cow. They have no choice. I can pound the gents out. Not chasing us anymore. Must not want a war with the Saints over some asshole's cow. I'm really sorry that didn't go down the way you wanted. Nah, those people weren't really art collectors. They were just assholes. I'll make it into the art world for real soon enough. At least I've got the Fisher pieces I always wanted. And I'm gonna treat them right. I mean, once I repair all the damage, we did liberating them. Confusion now that Sergio's dead. I think we broke their spine. Couldn't have happened to a bigger bunch of assholes. There's hardly any of them on the streets right now. It, it probably won't last, but this is a chance to really take a bite out of their territory. Kick them when they're down, you mean? With steel toed boots. Call me in if you decide to go for it. Pay attention next time and you'll <laughs> Hey, Kev. Eli's calling a board meeting. I'll meet y'all at home. Okay. We got the name, we got the space, we got the logo, we got the employees. And we got the fucking money. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Which means there's one thing left to do. How do we make a statement? Well... Uh, we just robbed a money train and killed Sergio in a particularly horrific fashion. Oh, so you ripped out Sergio's heart. I was there for moral support. It doesn't matter. Because word on the street is that the Nawali was a one-man wrecking crew. The Saints didn't get any shine from the heist. So, we're gonna need something that establishes us as an institution. Alright, so we need to do something that says, we're not going anywhere, come at us. Exactly. We steal the Hummingbird Codex. Marshall wanted to protect it. Panteros and the Idols wanted to steal it, and if it wasn't for that fucking book, we wouldn't have formed the Saints. It should be ours. I like it. How do we do it? I mean, I figured we'd just go in with a bunch of guns and kill the shit out of everybody. But if we want to do some heist movie stuff, I can work with that. Yeah, that's cool. Guns work. Sounds good. So the idols hide their stolen stuff in an abandoned boat shop? Under the boat shop. They've got stash houses all over the city. I figure the codex is probably there because it's closest to the museum. And it's practically next door to us? I know. Stealing the codex is going to be the easiest statement we ever made. Hells yeah! I'm good. Neon assholes! We're here to 
steal back the codex you stole after it was stolen from other people. at the bottom of those stairs. Locked us in. Congratulations on proving your own predictability. Toad's predictability. That's not the codex. It's another fake and a bomb. That's okay. I can disarm this. Probably. Martial training. Martial training. Got it. <sighs> Those fuckers almost You're fucked us up. And we better fuck them up twice as much to make our statement. You mean find the Codex and bust some serious heads? Hells yeah! I don't think the bomb went off! So we do this the fun way! We fight as one! Fight as one whole move! Ooh. isn't here, where would they have taken it? They didn't just move the codex. They emptied this whole place. So how do you empty a boathouse? Of course! The Collective's yacht! It's like their HQ. I bet they transferred everything there. Then that's where we're going next. There's some jet skis out back. We can grab one of those. The idols won't shoot at their own jet skis. This is gonna be an epic statement. That yacht's guarded AF. Dude! AF? Yeah, it's an abbreviation. First, we fucking swear all the time. Second, it's only an abbreviation when you text. AF, as fuck, same number of syllables. Okay, fine. This is gonna be an epic statement because that yacht is guarded as fuck. And every last one of them is gonna learn what happens when you try to blow up a saint. Hells yeah! We're gonna want a different way back. It would suck to get the Codex wet. No worries. Call home for a ride. Hey, Nina. Can you send a helicopter to pick us up from the Collective's yacht? Are you two crazy? Let me see who I can find. Really gun for the jumps. That should do it. We can use those ramps to get onto the yacht. Let's go find 
in the codex. You tell everybody the same. Third for the collective. Nina sent me with the chopper. I'll just hover over till you're ready to go. I'm sorry. Did you think you were safe here? I'm good. Ah! Ha! We got the co- Oh, shit. It's booby-trapped. Again? I'm getting really tired of defusing these things. Got the pink wire. Got it. Fucking fucks. They nearly blew us up again. I say we return the fucking favor. Hells yeah. I got the codex. Let's get this bomb to the bridge. It's hot. Run! Ha! We got the codex, planted a bomb, and are gonna get away clean on our own helicopter. Now that's a statement. ourselves on a boat with a live bomb and a bunch of angry idols? Hell. Yeah. Huh. Not the future saints are! Advance for the collective! Die like a oh. hunter! Oh. I did that. That was me. <laughs> a new world will rise from our ashes. Four out of six collective members down! We should probably get out of here before our bomb blows up. Good call. Ah, oh, shit. Holy shit! Just keep your head down and run. Don't get too close to the flames and you'll be fine. Ah! <laughs> Let's grab that speedboat. Shove the codex in the watertight compartment. I'll drive. Whew. Things got a little crazy over there. Seriously. Why does stuff like that keep happening to us? I don't know. Prison riots, derailing trains. It's almost enough to make you question your old way of... Look out! Idols on jet skis with machine guns! Let's fuck them up. Hells yeah! I'm gonna head for home. You give them a reason not to follow us. Codex stars, asshole! I always had it. Fuck with the 
Ah! now so what were we saying huh when just now before the jet skis and stuff uh probably that we were awesome stole the codex and fucked up collective hq yeah i'm sure that was it talk about a goddamn statement hells yeah buddy hells yeah with the saints no one i said who messes with the saints no one you're goddamn right no one the saints aren't a flash in the pan we're here to stay <laughs> the four of us founded the saints but it belongs to all of us it belongs to anyone who dreams of making something of themselves and are fucking tired of the world trying to hold them back Life is hard enough without having to deal with middle managers with no discernible talent telling you how to do your job. Without having to deal with assholes who've had every opportunity handed to them but never had to fucking work for a single one of them. Without being told that your time will come, you just have to wait. Be patient. Well, let me tell you something. We're fucking done waiting. We all did the work. Now it's time for us to reap the benefits. Kev, I think it's time you throw us a hell of a party. Yo! Yo! I'm setting up for the party. The word on the street is the idols are in total disarray now that we've blown up their yacht. The anarchists are in a state of chaos, huh? Who could have seen that coming? Looks like they've mostly gone to ground. For now, anyway. Might be a good time to move in on their turf. Kev just showed up with the party supplies. Want to lend a hand with decorating? Sure. How can I say no to streamers? Do you think we have enough crate paper? Come again? Crate paper. Do we have enough? <clears throat> it's crepe paper with a P. Really? Yeah, really. Sorry, folks. Party's over. Who the fuck are you? Chet Drummond, Marshal General Counsel. The Saints are now a wholly owned subsidiary of Marshal Defense Industries. Ha! Uh, no. The employment agreement you signed when we hired you contained a non-compete clause. I signed a lot of shit. I didn't actually read it. Not our problem. By attacking Marshal interests, to wit, the Frontier Prison, our cargo train, and various other assets, you became a competitor. So, what's your fucking point? Pursuant to Article 9, Section 12, Paragraph 36A, you have surrendered all rights and ownership of the Saints to us. Eli? Oh my god, he's right. Of course I'm right. I wrote the fine print myself. You are aware that didn't solve the issue, right? Yeah, but he was being a dick. <laughs> Atticus thinks we're gonna roll over while he takes what we built? Fuck that. I'm declaring all-out war on that asshole. Hell yeah! It's a revolution! I'll rally the troops. Tell everyone to meet us there.
You know Marsha won't fight this kind of war. They'll fight a war of red tape. We need to think this out. I have thought it out. I'm going to fucking kill Atticus. Saw well, that coming. But that won't solve our problem. It'll solve my anger. This is a binding legal document. You can't just shoot your way through it. Maybe we try using our words this time. Fine. I'll call Atticus and tell him why I'm going to fucking kill him. A step in the right direction. You have called Marshall Defense Industries. Please listen to the menu options as they have recently changed. Oh, what do I press to speak to a person? For customer service, press 1. For billing, press 2. For the complaints department, press 3. Oh, finally. are currently busy. To leave a callback number, press 1. To leave a message, press 2. To leave a death threat, press 3. Fuck you, 3! Sorry, that inbox is full. Goodbye. See? Dried words. Back to murder. Murder can't solve everything. You shut your mouth. I'm just saying we'll need to use our heads to get out of this one. This is more complicated than our usual shit. Look. Let's just kill Atticus first, so everyone can calm down, and then you can think of a real solution. Sounds like a win-win. You know, except for Atticus. But fuck him. Am I right? Wow! You know you two are being enablers right now. Looks like the gang's all here. We're here. Let's bust in and make our way to the top floor. That's where shitheads are. Bring me Atticus! Much as I love to see Atticus fight his own battles for us, that is not a stop. Can we take the elevator straight to him? Copy that. Stay safe. First, punch him in the face or kneecap him. You could just shoot him. Nah, I want to draw this out. Make him feel it, you know? Curb stomping? Ah, kind of a pain to haul him outside. None of that will help our cause. You know that, right? Then what will? We could tie it up in court. In court? We're criminals. Not in Marshall's books. I'm sure they'll list us as a corporate acquisition. Play it right and we could drag this out for years. We're not waiting years. Except for in this fucking elevator. Seriously, what the fuck? What happened? Why'd we stop? Security lockdown. We're on foot from here. Welcome to Marshall Defense Industries. Okay. Still got it. Sometimes. 
Won't take us years to get through it this way. We're not actually getting through. <sighs> Shit, it's a trap. There's snipers on the upper floor. I can snipe them back. Don't do that. Hey, if you get any downtime, search the legal files for documents on the acquisition. Do that. Check the desks. Someone always leaves their key card at work. Why can't I just shoot it? That's not how it works. I told you, you can't just shoot your way through all your problems. Ugh, fine. Looks like this elevator is the only way up. So let's go. No key card here. In a key card. There is an incoming call from Atticus Marshall. So, did you really think you could just waltz into my building and take your little saints back? <laughs> this assault is nothing more than a temper tantrum. You go ahead. Shoot whoever you like. I'll rehire. Destroy the whole fucking building. I'll rebuild. And it won't change anything. I'll still own you, because I have more lawyers than you have bullets. In the end, I will win. I will always win. Nothing here either. Uh. 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 Get a load of me. Got you out of You, so. you told me I'd find one in a desk. I had to murder this guy to get it. I guess we're both right. Shall we go? Welcome to Marshall Research and Development. 
to the Marshal Executive Floor. Intruders located. Putting them down. Well, shit. No surprise there. Ha! and shoot the pack. See if I can find anything useful in here. Do it yourself. I'm coming, motherfucker. Atticus, you son of a bitch! Wait, Myra Star? Didn't take you long to get up here. You are a plucky one. Where's Atticus? Oh, he turned tail and flew away the second you entered the lobby. I told him this whole saint's business would bite us in the ass, but he never listens. Then give us back the saints. As chair of the board, I could. Only problem is Atticus holds that title. That man has been a bee in my bonnet for a long time. How about we help each other out? Fine. Tell me where he is and I'll kill him. Now, not so fast. You kill Atticus and his seat on the board will pass to his next of kin, who won't help you. Then I'll kill them too. And then their kin, and then theirs. The Marshall family is large and ornery. They'll never help you. But you help me vote them off the board, and I'll scratch your back real good. So, how do we do that? If you make Atticus look bad enough, our company's stock price will tank. Shareholders will panic, and the board will have no choice but to change leadership. That's when I'll take over and give the Saints back to you. All right, you got yourself a deal.
Marshall is getting ready to host its annual expo. It'll be the perfect time to take Atticus down. Are you ready? Past ready. I'll let you know when we're in position. Good. I left you a thumb drive at a dead drop. You'll need the override codes on it. Got the thumb drive. Myra, it's me. The crew's all set. Fantastic. Atticus will be unveiling Marshall's new AI-powered tank at our expo today. You're going to steal the tank and cause mayhem in the city. And how does that get Atticus fired? A public debacle like this will cause Marshall's stock value to plummet. Once the board loses enough money, they'll drop Atticus like a two-ton turkey. All right, team. We're go. What's your status? I tailed Atticus to the expo. He's getting ready to give a press conference. Good. I want his reaction on film. Who's next? Now the hanging clods. They're ready to help us hack into the Marshall tank. Have him limber up those fingers then. Eli? I'm more comms. I'm watching the market and I've already shorted the stock. I don't know what that means, but it sounds good. I'll go get the tank and start blowing shit up. I'm here. You'll need physical access to the tank, so do something you wish to lure it out. Hey, assholes! Your security is shit! I could do something me-ish with that APC turret. I'm good. Deployed the tank. Great. Now get in the cockpit. What? You need to put the thumb drive in the control port. And at this point, it's probably safer inside than out. I'm in. Now what? Insert Myra's thumb drive with the override codes and you'll be good to go. What is happening? That was easy. Guess Marshall never thought one of their big wigs would help to boost one of their tanks. All right. Now that everyone thinks you're Marshall's state-of-the-art AI tank, go forth and destroy. Does it matter what I blow up? Whatever could be blown up should be blown up. The more public, the better. There's a strip mall near you that will make a good target. This is the best day ever. I think I found my new hobby.
make a bigger impact at the moment. They had no chance. statue. Taking out that smelter statue will turn all the fans against Marshall. Paulson's gonna regret buying that stock if you drop that statue. That's for hijacking our stock scan. Good. Also to back off now. Stock should go back down. Oh. Uh -oh. Problem here. I can shoot, but I can't move. Uh, looks like the drivetrain is overheating. We'll run a remote coolant flush, and you should be good to go. You uh, guys want to hurry up? Us hurry up. It wouldn't have overheated if you weren't driving it like a fucking rental. It's a simple fix. Hurry up. Go. I need to reload! Fuck! And now the guns aren't working! Cloud grenade! You're good to go. Thank you. Ah. I'm going around to the front of the stadium to blow the shit out of this expo. I really want to rub this in Atticus's face. Hey, Claude, that's the old fucker through. Hatching. Atticus, my man, what's up? What do you want? No, I don't have time for this. Because of that Marshall tank busting up the city? What do you know about that? Oh, it's me. What? Yeah, we hacked your tank. It's been me the whole time. You son of a bitch! When I get my hands on you! You won't, because I'm in your tank. Motherfucker! We need a tank of our own! Yeah, too easy. Buy something nice. Buy something? No, 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 no. We're reinvesting. I trust you, Eli. Buy low, sell high. You know what's low and guaranteed to go high when Lyra Star takes over? Marshall stock. Okay. As long as I get a cut. My, my. You actually did it. Lyra! Glad you like my work. Now, how's about we finish our deal? To the point. I like it. Come to my office and we'll sign the paperwork.
What the hell do you think you're doing? You're just in time for the vote. You think you could fire me? My family built this business! My name is on the goddamn building! Our stock price is rock bottom, and our shareholders want your head. It's the Saints! They exposed the frontier. They robbed my train. They ruined my good name! We've done the risk assessment, and you are a liability. Bullshit! This company's nothing without me! The motion is to terminate Atticus Marshall and appoint me chair of the board. All in favor? All opposed? You have a tie. Now what are you gonna do? Let's ask the tiebreaker. Atticus Marshall, you are fired. Get your hands off me! You haven't heard the last of Atticus Marshall! Yes, I'm sure we'll hear you hollering all the way down to the lobby. You held up your end of the deal. And now, so have I. The Saints are all yours. Thanks. We made a good team. Don't go mistaking us for friends. This was business. You interfere with Marshall again, and you'll get the horns. Looks like Myra Starr is as good as her word. We got the paperwork officially signing the Saints back over to us. Plus, it looks like she's pulling back on Marshall's military escalation. All those checkpoints on the west side have cleared out. Guess we really scared them off. More likely the bad press was starting to build up. Even in this country, you can't militarize a city that much without pissing people off. Whatever the reason, let's take the win. Back to business as usual for the Saints. I hate it when things are too quiet. <laughs> Wonder if the Saints will help me shake down my landlord for a discount. Keep it on till the break of dawn. Hi, boss. You should totally jump on the Wanted app. Easy way to make some extra cash. <laughs> that reminds me of a funny story I'll tell you one of these days. This room is the bomb. Nice to see you. Yeah, well, maybe I didn't want to do anything today. You better be buying us food later. Hey, where are you? Big party's getting started. I cannot kick it off without you. Crap. I lost track of time. On my way. I wouldn't miss it for the world. You sure you're at the right party? This is a celebration for the Saints, is it not? We got a party going on, so I'm gonna keep this one short and sweet. Fuck the Panteros. Fuck the Idols. Fuck Marshall. The Saints are here to stay, baby! We built this... together. Thanks for getting shot, Eli. 
Should we go in? You guys go. I just want to take a minute out here. Heard there's a party. <laughs> hey! It's good to see you, man. I've been thinking a lot about what you said. About the Saints. I've been alone for a long time. I always viewed friends as a liability, a weakness. But I was wrong. Seeing you with Kev, Nina, Eli, they really make you stronger. Yeah, they really do. I want to know what that feels like. Well, let's go. Why? Well, because I cannot live your life if you are still breathing. You have a lot of heart, but let's face it, I'm just a, a better version of you. You could not even protect yourself. How would you ever protect your friends if someone like me came along, huh? This is for the best. Uh, do not worry. I'll keep our friends safe. Uh, where am I? Snickerdoodle? Los Panteros aren't my car anymore. Hey, Nina's car. Boy, it was a beaut. My family's so far away, you know? It feels like I'm keeping part of them with me. This is where all our dreams are true. Eli's whiteboard. I feel like there's a lot we're missing. There is, but it's enough to go on for now. Dinner and a show, baby. Waffle iron. Did we ever get that for Kev? I. I can't remember. Oh, thanks for the rescue. Really owe you one. Forget it, man. We're family. What is it I can't remember? I was supposed to do something. <coughs> You're right, I am late. I just can't remember for what. <coughs> All right, game night. Guys, sorry I'm late. No worries, we started without you. Hurry up if you want in. Hey, glad you made it. You've got some catching up to do, but you might still win if you collect three more bears. And I can help you with that. If you get me seven measly little llamas, I will give to you this extremely valuable bear. Seven to one? That's highway robbery. But I'm in. Where those llamas at? Jackpot. I take delivery of seven llamas and present to you one bear. Thanks, man. My bear's gonna kick your llama's ass. Game ain't over. It's Nina's turn.
Welcome to the party. Glad to be here. How can I help you? I've got almost a full collection of elephants, but the baby ran away. I've got a second bear for you if you can find it for me. One baby elephant coming up. Still waiting on that elephant. Snakes? I didn't know we were playing with the snake expansion. Don't blame us. You're the one who bought it. Okay. Come here, elephant. Come on now. There we go. Don't run. It's okay. Fuck! It bit me! What did you expect? It's a snake. There's my baby elephant! Come get your bear! Aw, Mira, que cute! Thank you! And here is your bear. Pleasure doing business with you. Okay, Kev, your turn. Hey, buddy. Hey, yourself. What can I do for you? I'm playing a snail strategy tonight. Find me three snails, and I will give you this bear I just happen to have in my hand. Last bear for the win. Wait, where did all the snails go? They're hiding, but come on. You can outsmart snails, can't you? One snail. Damn snakes. Hey, nobody made you buy the expansion. Two snails. God damn it. Snakes keep getting in the way. What? Oh, they are coming from the barn. That's weird. Yeah, I should go in there and root him out. Forget about the stupid old barn. Stay here and play with us. Last bear for the win. I don't know. Snickerdoodle's right. I've gotta go in there and deal with the snakes. Hey, Snickerdoodle. Eli! You should have listened to your friends. You should have known better than to play with snakes. Help me! Somebody help! Eli? I'm coming! Where are you? <laughs> If you'd been there at the idols party, I wouldn't have gotten shot. You let your friends get hurt because you were wallowing in your own self pity. What kind of friend does that? I could use some help here, Nina. You're back. You? You couldn't even kill Sergio. The Nawali had to do it for you. I... You talk a good game when you're safe at home. But when it matters, you let your friends down. You do not have what it takes. When the real bad guys show up to play, you come up snake eyes. <laughs> Why 
continue to fight? Help! Anybody there? I'm here! Kevin, I'm here! Kev? I wasn't calling you. Don't you get it? You're just not a good enough friend. No. You can't do anything right. You ruin everything. That's why you needed me. Now you're dead, and everything you built is mine. Your friends are mine, your empire is mine. The saints are all mine. Like hell they are. Nina? Kev? Eli? Anybody? You have three new messages. Hey! It's Kev! Where are you at? The crate paper's up, the music's pounding, the party's starting! Where did you go? Antonio's still waiting to talk to you. Dude's sitting here with a big briefcase of money. Let's not leave that on the table, huh? Where the fuck are you? The Nawali's gone crazy! He's shooting! Hi, Nina. You will not be needing your phone any longer. Oh, God. Everything smells amazing, Kev. Uh, you know what would make it smell even better? Let me guess. Pancakes. You know it. <laughs> Hey, look who's home. How was your day? <sighs> Not bad. I got some blood on my favorite shirt. <laughs> Sounds like you could use some champagne. Hmm. Thanks, Eli. Please, sit. So, what did you all do today? You know what we did. You're upset. You think? I do not like to see you upset. Well, maybe you should have thought of that before. Nina, please. We'll discuss your gratitude later. Hello. Where are they? They're safe. I am coming for you, motherfucker. Good. It'll save me some time. I'm sorry. That threw me off. Uh, okay. <clears throat> we'll try this again with a little more energy. And Kev, be sure to have some club soda ready, eh? I don't want this stain to set. Everything smells amazing, Kev. Guns. I need guns to rescue them. Yeah, okay. I know where to get those. Kev, I 
cop. The cop. Yo, this is Kevin. My phone's on silent, so leave a message after I drop the beep. Wait for it. Wait for it. Kev, I don't know if you'll... when you'll get this. Everything's going to be fine. I'm coming to get you, okay? I won't let you down. Hello. You've reached Eli's voicemail. I can't come to the phone right now, but if you'll leave a message, you can trust I'll get back to you within a reasonable time frame. Eli, it's me. You hang in there, okay? You're not gonna get hurt this time. I'm on my way. This is Nina, you know what to do. Hey, Nina, I'm coming. I'm gonna kill the bad guy this time. Quick. Hey, fuck what? Guess where I am? In your house! Taking your stuff! <laughs> I'm waiting for you. Let's finish this back where we began it. this where we began it? That's definitely a trap. Fuck, I got no other leads. Guess I'm gonna walk into this trap. Next stop, Silver Gulch. Okay, gotta get psyched. Oh, I know. But only you can decide how you react to adversity. Only you can choose to adapt to the changes that life throws your way. Your friends deserve better. You deserve better. You are more than a cog in a corporate machine. You are not defined by your student debt or your useless degree. You have more agency and power than the world wants you to know. But to realize that power, there's something you need to do. You need to be your own boss of your job, of your happiness, of your life. You don't make $15 an hour, no. You're selling hours of your life away for 15 bucks a piece. So what do I say to the person who wants to get paid what they deserve? Be your own boss. That's right, be your own boss. Now, life, am I right? Life is full of adversity and challenges. But if you want to learn from your mistakes instead of getting punished for someone else's, what are you gonna do? You've been an amazing audience. T-shirts, DVDs, and signed photos are available for purchase in the lobby. Thank you, Stillwater, and good night. Don't worry, guys. I'm coming. You gonna come out and face me? Or do I gotta come to you like last time? See you soon. All right, here's the deal. You motherfuckers know where your boss is keeping my friends. So, how about you just tell me, and then I can be on my way? Any takers? I know it's not likely, but, you know, I figure I should do due diligence. It's really in your best interest. I, I only need one of you live to tell me what I need to know, and the odds of it being you is pretty... 
You know what? Fuck it. I tried. One asking for it. Ah! Cutting them off. You will die in silver. Tell me where your boss is. Go for cover! You'll never leave this place alive! Uh. Uh. Back. You gonna tell me what I want to know? Uh. I'm good. I'm listening. Happy with that. Tell me where my friends are. Better shot. You will not live long enough to find your friends. Nawali, get out here and face me yourself. We will never betray the Nawali. Metrics not recognized. I'm good. Biometrics recognized. Welcome, employee 92245. Huh. Guess this old Marshall stuff still has me in the database. Bet I can make him talk now. Smaller than I remembered. Oh, crap. 
crap. Did I kill them all again? Oh, good. There's more. Holy shit, there's more. Can't believe this hunk of junk is still here. Secret dies with you? Okay, if that's what you want. Guess you didn't want to tell me. How about you? You're not gonna stop without answers. You want some love too? I'm good. fucking day. Can we? Can we please be reasonable people? I can. You're gonna say you can't tell me because the Nawali will kill you, then I'll say if you don't tell me, I'll kill you, and we're just gonna be right back to where we started, so let's just skip that part. No, I was gonna say I can put the address in your phone. Oh. Uh, yeah. No. <clears throat> That'd be super helpful. You mind unlocking it? Whoops. Sorry about that. Uh... You're a fucking maniac. Well, you know, I have a lot of practice and pent-up rage. I hear that. Parents? Alimony. Ah. Anyway, secret bunker address is in there. Thanks, man. I'm George, by the way. You're an all right guy, George. When you wake up, you should stop by the church. The saints could use a guy with some common sense. Oh! Now, let's see if my biometrics still work on this VTOL. There you are. Rocket launchers, cute. the afterlife. It's real fun. You got a fucking VTOL, dumbass. You can't even slow me down.
got it. And done. Now for the inside. Let's do this. How long are we gonna play house for this nut job? Hey, look, as long as he's happy, we're not dead. We just need to figure out a way to escape. Maybe I could poison his food? He makes you eat whatever you cook for him. I can take one for the team. Don't be crazy. What if we try? Holy shit, are we mic'd? No. This is something else. I want them secured. What's going on? It's for your own safety. It's our roommate, isn't it? They're here to say. Save, <clears throat> save you? Is that what you... Eli, I'm sorry I hit you. There's a lot going on right now, and I got upset. Everything's going to be fine. Don't worry, guys. I'm coming. Nina? Kev? Eli? You need not worry over their safety. They are with me now. Alas, you will not survive long enough to see this for yourself. I'm coming to end you, asshole! Just gotta do this first. You're never gonna get past them! and die already. Oh, too easy. I crawled out of my grave to send you to yours. Do not worry, my friends. Things are going back to the way they were. You guys okay? We're fine. Why is Kev wearing a shirt? Oh, it's a lot. Look out! <laughs> Don't you see? You were never meant to protect them! You don't get it. They don't need my help. I need theirs. Good now. Well, I'll be better when I get this stupid shirt off.
I am tired of playing hide and seek. Hell no. Protect yourself! Damn. Still got it. Get back here, you coward! Don't worry. We can handle the small fries. You go kill the shit out of that asshole. You got this. Right. I got this. Ugh. You're taking the elevator? Come on, face me! Too easy.
You should have stayed in the ground where I left you. They won't see me coming. Get behind the thing. You ruined every... You guys should come up here. It's a hell of a view. Mortal terror aside, today was a good day. Yes, sir, it was. I'm really sorry, guys. About what? You saved our ass. It was also my idea to get the Nawali's help in the first place. No one could have predicted that much crazy. Bad hires happen. It's okay. No. If anything happened to you guys, I... Hey, we love you. I love you guys, too. That's because we're fucking awesome. Here, here. You know, the Saints have only been around for like a minute, and we've already gained and defeated a nemesis. Not a bad start. No. Not bad at all. <laughs> <laughs> 